Welcome to Assassin's Creed, Doc. <laughs> um, Why does that say test widget not live? What are you talking about? Page look, bitch. Welcome back <laughs> to the DVD campaign, Christmas Star Crusade. I'm your boy here. Uh, bingo, bango, bongo. Fuck you. Anyways. You have disadvantage for your first roll because you said I'm your boy. Uh, <laughs> Jeb boy. Jeb boy. Today we're fucking wrong about everything. So. Jeb boy. What the fuck is the truth? Who all had inspiration? I did. I did. Oh, I did. I did not. The fuck? The, 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 I, I uh, used mine, I think. The trailer for, for the new D D movies out. You'll be watching this like in the years from now. So this is just to stay in there. Put my chair. Friends, so. so go back and watch that on YouTube. Is that yours? They'll have rebooted D and D twice by then. No, it's for that laptop. Too. Okay. Anywho, Curse of Scarlet Crusade. Uh, we are back. Last week. What? Curse of the Scarlet Colt. Yeah, Curse of the Scarlet Crusade. Uh, oh my goodness. Cool. So we get attacked. Don't worry about it. We'll call uh, the police. Let them, let them <laughs> it shouldn't have broken into the house. Yeah, it shouldn't break into the house. Uh, so last week, as everybody is aware, we more about the wife and the dog. Yeah. Um, yeah, dogs can't hold Yeah, because yeah, the dog can't hold up. Right. right. Hello. Um, <laughs> so last week, uh, we went out um, trying <laughs> to progress farther in the Rogue Olympic storyline. Um, Roland got some information from the Golden Truffles. Uh, or uh, the Gilded Mushroom. I don't fucking know what the name yep, is. Yep, Gilded Truffle. Okay. Between two attempts, he got all Gilded the Truffles. Right. Gilded Truffles. Truffle. Yeah, the Gilded Truffle. Right, so they wanted to, wanted him to sneak into a subsection uh, of the Gilded Truffle that we're doing. Yep, so, safe house. What? Safe house, yep. Yep, we had, so we broke into the safe house, got all the way in, got all the way into the basement. Right, I think it's our safe house. Now. Uh, I mean, we killed everybody, so, I mean, the possession is not yeah. the law, right? Um... So, murdered everybody. Uh, come to find out there was a vampire that was playing some nasty little tricks on some fucking people. Uh, ended up just molly the entire team down there. Solid rolls, crits all around the fucking board, except for the druid who was not here. Um, he so, would have yeah. rolled good. Anyway. He, no, he would have. He would have thrown, like, maybe a lady boy. Right. right. Um, you got some going bears. I'm pretty sure we're going to cancel this. <clears throat> so, ASMR. you can say lady boy as long as you're in support of it. Anyways, not so. There's anything wrong with that. <laughs> right. Don't be smelling up. <laughs> I'm not sure what the fuck's going on that side of the table. But, it in hey, smell this. No, thank you. <laughs> what do my fingers smell like? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, today we're going to get back into like it. Protein we have, uh... Ooh. Oh my god, this one of my friends, what Andrew just... something says, smell this? Yeah. I'm not fucking hey, doing it. Hey, it's full of random It smells like the alcohol. It's a scary movie with Oscar Doofy. He's like, smell my finger. Yeah. Oh, what is he? <laughs> oh, shit. You know what's funny? <laughs> you know what's funny? I was going to say that. I was going to put a meme in the group chat today with Oscar Doofy in reference to something you just said about him. Oh, my bad. Yeah, about your bad. Special Officer Doofy so report just, for duty. Exactly. <laughs> so, yeah. So, uh, so we just completed the long rest. We leveled up to level eight. Uh, Druid's still level six. Who's a druid? He starts out at level oh, one. Wait a second. Yeah. No. Um, so, <clears throat> we are level six. We just finished you running can't away just back. Roll a new character to level six. The you uh, headquarters to uh, turn in the paperwork that we got from the hideout. Don't mention yep. anybody else. I'm going to need 50 pies. Yep. <laughs> 70 and, wolf uh, pies. Yeah. So but only the back. white wolves. Yeah. Take away 10. Oh, well, I'm sorry. I'm no, you're fine. telling Mario what the side quests are. No, fuck the side quests. Uh, he's gotta, uh, no, he's got to do them on his own. He's got to drag them out every week. Yeah, he's got dailies to do. Yeah. yeah. That's he's found our new monsters. That's all we need. That's all we need. Yeah. 50 Once we beat one, we're, that's all our new minis. The enemy minis are going to be candy. If those are the sugar free Haribos. I'm going to laugh my ass off if both of you guys are running the bed. Yeah, nah. Right? Are they sugar free? Oh, probably. You don't eat sugar. I eat gummy bears. These are like my curse. What are they? Gummy burr. I'm gonna eat it, but I'm it's, not gonna smell it. <laughs> it's cheap day for it's cheap day for Gage apparently. It's a gummy burr. Gage, if you get fat, who are we gonna sell to the ladies? Hello. I mean, have you seen have you seen this face when it didn't have this nasty ass beard? He's gonna look like the best sex magnet. He's gonna look like Spider Man's best friend from No Way Home. See, here's the thing though. Right? <laughs> <laughs> if I almost so good, he had an instant. <laughs> <laughs> It's just for the cushion, right? Just so they have a spot to sit. It's not super rough. That's not what I use mine for, but I mean, that's what I use whatever makes you happy. That's, that's not me. It's my wife. Your wife's got a <laughs> No. It was a, it was a sit on my face joke. You wouldn't know because you can't grow a fucking beard. Nope. Nope. Yeah. You're still a fake beard. At least I got our pair. So. <laughs> <laughs> no, you don't! No, you don't! Hey, short <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Welcome to the ninth grade locker room. <laughs> At least I have cubes. <laughs> <laughs> you guys allowed to grow facial hair in school? Yeah. In school? Yeah, in high school. No. I, I couldn't have facial hair. You should have been banned all those crustaceans. No. No. Well, I, I, yeah, I had the school. I went to my school at a dress code. I didn't care. My school had a dress code. I had the Mexican stash. <laughs> I just rocked the vote the for Pedro. Yeah, yeah the vote for Pedro that. stash. Just the corners. Remember when the, the, the hairs first started coming in real dark? You know, it's like Saturday, Friday, Friday. Yeah. So when it's like really fucking dark right here where there's nothing up top, it's all like, oh, yeah. There's a picture with me and Super we patchy. Together, and it's so like a patchy all over the place. It just looks like somebody just took like a highlighter and just rubbed it on my upper lip. And you thought you were just grizzly <laughs> Oh, fuck yeah. I was just like, oh, I'm a sex fucking man. <laughs> you wear a phone? I said, I'm a grown ass adult. <laughs> I still work for sure. Alright, so you guys have wrapped up the, uh, you defeated the, uh, rogue element of the Gilded Truffle. Uh, you stopped their experiments with the Sorrow Sworn. Uh, but that, that sorcerer or wizard left, right? And, uh, there was a wizard that escaped, so you're not completely free and clear, but you did what you promised oh, wow. to do. So now you can get the price removed from Roland's head, and in theory, uh, then become a free potentially agent. Potentially get sponsored by the other guild, the Rat, the sign of the Rat, to uh, to head down to the Rogue Olympics. Uh, you have also discovered a uh, an invitation for a free spa day for one for one guest and their retinue at a uh, relaxation spa called the Temple of the Restful Lily. Ooh! Oh yeah, it's from the. It was on the blood spattered map. Yeah, that's the, that's the free massage for group and handies. Yep, yep. One one party member. Oh. oh, one one guest and their retinue. They're assuming it's going to be a rich person who's going to bring like servants. Retinue just means posse, right? Entourage. Entourage. Friend. Oh, oh that's the next campaign. Hold on, Entourage. is the whole posse getting massage parlor Entourage. hand jobs? Entourage, yes. the TV series, the D and D campaign. I've never watched that, but it does You've good. never watched Entourage? I didn't feel like it. Like it. Yeah. it may be it may be the broiest bro show of all time. Hug it out, bitch. It's like they even have a Mario. His name is Turtle. Hey. It's like Eastbound and Down, but not Less as with the Metro with, with the metrosexuals. Like <laughs> I love that. You've you've seen it, right? Like Steve. Tell me Mario is not Steve Janowski. <laughs> Percent. That was my favorite character, Stevie. <laughs> anyway, when do they go to Mexico? The fuck are you doing? Jet ski. That was me. I'm just Kenny Powers. I'm not that fast as fuck. <laughs> All right, so let's go to uh, the headquarters of the, the Gilded Truffle. Uh, all right, so yeah, you guys have the, the, the invitation for the free spa day. You can go uh, talk to. Uh, Grandfather Knuckles to see if the sign of the rat is ready. Uncle to. Knuckles? Uncle Knucklefucker. Oh my god. Did we have Father to. Father Knuckles? Uncle Knuckles. Did we have to uh, go to the, the leader of the Guild of Trouble? No, you already did what you. Well, I mean, you can if you want to, but you already did what you were supposed to do. So he's aware of our actions already? I don't know. Or do you guys want to go get Mahito? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, All right. But, well, I would say that Roland, at least, it would occur to Roland as a career criminal that. Uh, now that you've completed your end of the bargain, if you go back and they've already gotten you to do what they wanted you to do, they can just decide to kill you. I keep doing that. Although killing trying. you guys is really hard. I keep trying. Yeah, I know. You work. It worked for one person. <laughs> killing everyone from Mario. Is I feel so better. Hard. I feel so like better. better. I cannot <laughs> wait to hit a next I mean, boulder that casts disintegration rate at one of us. Because then I'm just going to cloud root that to you again. Just so you have to. Yeah, can't, I didn't have a chance. Can't stop and tackle. Today's the day that you're Don't be a dick, Dad. <laughs> can't you just, like, just let us murder Mario? Yeah, just, let's just buddy fuck somebody, all right? Oh, my God. Friendly fire is on, okay? Dude, I'll well, friendly fire is definitely up. on. I'll let you nuke each other, but only, you know, the right. way it actually works. Uncle Knuckles? It's your fault, Mario. You were the wizard. You had the chance to friendly fire everybody, and then you're like, no, I'm fighting Drew again. Uh, <laughs> if you had just killed every holder quicker, then you'd be so alive. Yeah. Or just get the fuck out of the line. So. Anyway, what do you guys want to do? Uh, Uncle Knuckles. 
Okay. Yeah. You head down to head down to Grandfather yeah. Muckle's uh, pawn shop. What? We keep an uncle and he said Grandfather just because that's me. his actual name is Grandfather Muckle. Oh, Did he have kids? Uncle Muckle fucker. Not that you know of. But how's he a grandfather? They call him Grandfather because he's a really <clears throat> most thieves don't live to be that old. So if he's not a grandfather, you're saying he could be an uncle? Possibly. Okay. You don't know his family. You don't know his family. I like my pastry check. <laughs> sure. Can we you could probably do that. Sure. Well, he can. No. Most useless bit of fucking information I've ever done. <laughs> 11. As far as you know, he's telling the truth. I'm telling the truth. I'm telling the truth. I'm telling the truth. As far as you know, he's telling the truth. As far as you know, he has no uh, no family. Although it occurs to you that if you did have a family, you wouldn't tell people that in the tra- circles you travel with. Oh, yeah, I guess that makes I sense. I won't inside against you, Ted. Congratulations. You know what? You know what we could do? We could kill him and then just watch the funeral from a distance. I'm going to start doing I'll give you guidance. When I, <laughs> this is a 19th time to tell the truth. When I worked in the daycare, I learned this this thing when a kid says something really dumb and you're like, yes, you did. I'm, I'm going to start doing that to you every time. All right. Well, that won't, even apply to dumb kid. that won't even apply to us because we're not dumb kids. Duh. No, you're not. We're just dumb adults. <laughs> <laughs> See how that works? It's great. I'm not saying I apply, I'm not saying I apply preschool tactics to you guys frequently. I'm just saying. Oh, uh, anyway. It only works on See, what? It only works on games. Like the, the dog rewarding thing? Like when you do a yeah. good job, you, you get to Oh, see I shouldn't, I shouldn't do that. I should start bringing, you know when we're at work, if Gage is in a dispatch, you flip the lights twice, yeah. he goes and takes a nap. Correct me if I'm wrong, <laughs> but didn't you already bring treats for the class? Yeah. But the only one that ate one was Mary. Is she really? Yeah. I feel like they're just doing it. Yeah. Oh, okay. I would not put my mouth on that. At this point, <laughs> I'm not looking to shit myself. No thanks. Hashtag Do it. Um, all right. So you make your way over to, to uh, Grandfather what Muckles. What happened to it? I ate my inspiration. <laughs> uh, a pawn shop. You walk in. You see he's dealing with a customer who's uh, heading out. He kind of looks you guys over and he says, oh. So uh, you guys look like you've been through the ringer. Do anything special? Yeah, I, uh, I put my hand on the counter. And I'm just tapping it. He looks it. He looks at, at Stargazer or whatever his name is and he goes, what the hell's the new guy? Uh, I don't know, somebody he, who pissed on his, our old friend's corpse. Actually, he shit on it. It was a term of endearment and a sign of respect. Yeah, or so I would, us, do you know where that city guard is? Because this guy's fucking weird. Or so they told me. You trying to give me candy? these mushrooms? No, I paid for their friendship, so they said they're my friends. Oh, that's not how any of this works. Yeah, but you got to say this every week. Hey, that's a weekly fee. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> You're renting the space. <laughs> that's the way friendship works for everyone. Uh, you guys are my top five on my street right now. That's the case until you go down to Michigan and buy some more friends. <laughs> you just mentioned my space. You got a good spot? Is that what you're saying? 2002. I over there. I know a couple spots. It's right across the street from the White Castle. Uh, well, what are you here for? <laughs> Uh, Talk to the fucking Joe. You You're scared away my customers. He did what you They should be scared. Look at uh, this. I am no longer marked. No. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. All right. Oh, <laughs> you know, I forgot one more thing. You guys are, I don't know, mouth off to the Shogun. There's no fucking way we do that, Uncle Knuckle Fucker. <laughs> he kissed his foot. I do not have I no, we, heard that. We uh, we made we made good of them. Unconscious first. We made good of them. We went to his house. Yeah. Sure, we did. Went to his dojo. Remember? He wasn't here that day. Oh, all right, Mario. Go watch. Uh, go go watch. Go watch the eighties movie, The Last Dragon. You'll be all caught up. Yeah. Sure enough. It's already up here. Just went through it. I don't know. Fuck. Yeah, that was when I had to play the tank that day. At a one one, they dipped all. Didn't their, work out great They dipped their balls in the hand washing bowls, and uh, yeah. if they weren't for balls, it wouldn't be that hard. So what about the shogun? What do you mean? What do you mean? Disrespected him? 
It's all over. It's all over the. It's all over the streets. Uh, streets. Yeah. So streets. You talk about us. Yeah. Oh, we're fine. The streets been talking about you guys for a while. Good things. Yeah, I'm sure. Okay. Good, good, good. Yep. Kind of roll inside to see if he's aware of it. Do you want to know? Sure. <laughs> he says, I don't know. Listen, listen. Listen. I'm not your dad. It's not my job to tell you what. Well, you're our grandpa. But you guys have made me some coin. I've helped you make some coin. So take this for whatever it's worth. No matter how tough you think you are, some people are not worth pissing off. Okay. And where are those I people? I like to counter. That's right. And say, I don't need those people. But we'll agree what you going to do? Hey, that's a nice looking repair you got there. Nice. Want to sell it? How much? Well, I don't think I have enough coin laying around. But uh, what kind of weapons do you favor? Uh, the magic a double sided dildo. Yes. <laughs> Are those bludgeoning then? Or is that a dual it's purpose a bludgeoning and piercing? piercing. Yeah. <laughs> I said acidic damage. I said weapon. Weapon? Um, Did you say acidic? Uh, battle axe. Any, like, uh, anything that I can use with one hand, but also two hands. And also, and then he whips no out his dick. <laughs> and no hands. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, I think I can. I think I can. Uh, maybe something that I can throw. To. Pull something out for a for a trade in the area of a, of a weapon that you can wield one or two handed. It might be of similar value if you wanted to consider a trade. Look at spec what you're talking about first. It says, why don't you guys go down and uh, meet up with the the little fellow who runs the side of the rack. And uh, find the lo- get the location of the of the thing you're trying to find, uh, the event, and then when you're done with that, come back here, and I might have something you'd be interested in trading for. Okay. Also, just in case that you can't find a weapon, also potentially uh, a little bit of maybe some new armor, a little bit more polished, a little bit more sturdy. You know what I mean? It's got plus one at the end of it. It's got plus four. It's got to have utter holes, though. Fucking right. You don't get to say that joke since <laughs> you never fucking done. How about that? Whoa. Whoa. This is your, this your Whoa. first, this is your first day with him. What are you talking about? Yeah. You've never even met him yet. Hey, hey that's, that's me. Don't yeah. fucking come over here and move in my face. I'll move right the fuck back. Um, Question for Uncle Grandpa. <laughs> Well, how does he how does he feel about my new um uh holy symbol? He looks at it and goes, I don't recognize it. Hmm. He's a high priest or something. Like Is that. he wearing the ring? Yeah. How do I feel around him? Uh more respectful already. Right? Oh. We do this every time. <laughs> the answer's always Tell me the how same. I feel. <laughs> so confused. Always the same. Hey, try to get that ring back for me. <laughs> no. I'm going to put it on my mechanical hand. <laughs> so it's fucking useless. Your hand just grows right back over all the metals. So, uh, you want us to go see some little people? I just need you to give me some time. I don't care what you do. Oh, okay. Right. Yeah, sure. All right. Well, we'll, we will go see. Uh, we'll go fuck off. Yeah. When you come back, uh, turn the clothes sign and shut the, shut the blinds when you come in. Oh, oh eyes wide shut party, huh? No, we're going to be conducting business. I don't want outsiders to see. Is yeah, he's going to he's going to pull a Houdini on you. <laughs> no, but, no, but the safe word word is miracle. 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 Also, he's he's the only one that's going to need. Don't worry. Okay, that works. Mm. All right, so uh, we'll we'll called you a little bit. We'll go see the little miracle. Bit. Um, yeah. you want to take a long rest? We, we, did. we did. We did. All right. Somebody's paying. Alright, let's go uh, talk to the guy from the Gilded Rat. Alright, so you're, you're heading back to the uh, the inn? To the tavern that's on the ship. Yes. Which I forgot the name of already. I have to go back and watch last week's stream. Uh, Alright. So why is the Shogun pissed off at us? I thought we... He didn't say the Shogun was pissed off at you. He oh. said you disrespected the Shogun. Oh. No, it kind of means the same thing, but it don't mean the same thing. 
We made it. We made a truce, though, at the end of, of that episode. United States and Russia had this fucking truce. We can't be pissed off at each other. Well, basically, basically, the Shogun made a deal with you guys that he was. He's trying to deal with something that's also been a problem for you guys. A friend of my enemy, or the enemy of my friend. The enemy of my enemy is my friend. He's like a level. Right. He's like a level twenty monk, though. You know what I mean? A monk's are useless anyway. Yeah, I know. Yeah. All they do is throw fucking darts. Yeah. Or have scores. Wow, man. Gage just poisoned the whole monk experience. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I guess I'll just throw a dart. <laughs> <laughs> So you guys head down, head down, back down to the docks. Uh, ride, it's the same filthy, crime-infested place it always is. Uh, you make your way back to the barge that's like slightly tilted and horribly unsafe. Uh, but when you get there, you see that the barge is uh, partially like in the water. It's tilted like more more than it was like, like high tide titanic or yeah. beached sideways but like titanic like bad it's it's screwed up listing uh, yeah but it's listing to the point where it's obviously filling with water and, you're still uh, talking about excel spreadsheets with them on yep, ship? Yep. and you see you see a bunch of you see you know there's a bunch of people standing around watching you know, like gossiping about what happened and everything. And uh, as you're watching, you feel a tug on your pants from behind. And oh, yeah, snuck up on him. The halfling, the halfling guy. I did not. I knew he was there. The halfling guy, guy goes, heads, heads away from the crowd. You guys following him? Or? Sure. I mean, did we notice him leaving? Yeah. Unless he's trying to stealth. No, I'm not. Well, that's what we wanted figure out what's going on with the boat. Do we care about this boat? Not really. Okay. I'll try behind. Do I know it's really like glancing at us, following us from your eyes? Perception. Would I know my passive perception? Of 19? Yeah. Uh, yeah, there's definitely some people watching where you're going. Okay. 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 I, I hold my hands up in the air. And Nine. I do a little thieves can, and I go, I see you. Sorry. Nine. It's okay, though. <laughs> you're fine. Walk like this. They don't want to shoot. I didn't know. Oh, yeah, you're fine. Okay. Right. He, goes into a, he goes into a nearby into a nearby warehouse and, like, hops up on a, on a little crate, pulls out his pipe, lights it, smokes, and waits for you guys to come in and shut the door. I shut the door. Only the completely dark in here, so those of you without dark vision can't see shit. Uh, except for his occasionally flaring pipe. He says, I can see. I can see. Can you see? Yeah. Dark. Yeah. Well, you see. Dark. Listen, you cast light? Listen, I, I understand that, uh, I understand that, uh, I cast light. You got the head lifted off, the, the, head, the price lifted off your head. <laughs> yes, I got my head lifted up, yes. I light my torch. I cast the light. Oh, never mind. I still you light, light my torch. torch. <laughs> you see hundreds of rats scurry out of the, the uh, area of light. What a nasty ass place you take us to. It's a warehouse. I've been in a lot of those. There's no standards around here? I'm going to call OSHA. Magic OSHA. <laughs> <laughs> they actually can get shit done. Yeah. Uh, he says, all right, so for our agreement, the sign of the rat is going to put you up as one of our two uh, representatives this, uh, this time around with this event. Can I be the second? No. So I have a teammate or is this someone? Uh, no, teammate? no, we just each, each, each guild gets to select two competitors. Okay. There's only one prize. Okay. Which is? A uh, personal item from the vault of Avery Night Eyes, the greatest thief of all time. Yeah. Vault who's the uh, Who's the other guy? Uh, that's no concern of yours. Who's the other guy? That's no concern of <laughs> yours. You go I'm there. Competing. You go there and do the best you can. All right. 
recruit. <laughs> so since you're since you're going to be uh, representing the sign of the rat, there's a few important things to know. If you get in, if you or those attending you get involved in any open conflict with other competitors, you will be immediately withdrawn from the competition. If uh, you know someone makes you angry, settle the score after the competition. Okay. What about self defense? Any conflict, any violent conflict. What if it's a raper? Any violent conflict. You'll allow it to happen. Deal with it later. <laughs> <laughs> what? So in that case, you just have to be a victim? Or? Yeah, I guess so. Has oh. it come up? I guess we're not going. <laughs> you got say, say, <laughs> okay, so that's so your problem. Okay, that's your problem. Is this going to be broadcasted on the Magic Box? <laughs> <laughs> not, a, not a thing. You guys don't have picture boxes? No. Oh. What do you got? What about picture movies? No. We know a tinkerer. He made one. I was just wondering. And he's dead, though. Yeah, it didn't happen. Uh, so, no, we don't have any of that. Uh, <laughs> and obviously, as this competition is held between, you know, criminal guilds, we do tend to keep its existence and the outcome uh, a secret. So are the political debates, but we air those. <laughs> that was really funny. Uh I don't know where Gage like, came up with that one. He ran right on the back of a pop. <laughs> <laughs> he flipped through PBS going to the Pokemon channel. That's where he <laughs> uh, he was enjoying Daniel T. Ray after. So, anyway. All right, so we can't fight. Anybody have other opposing? How do we know if they're going to be a part of another opposing criminal guild? They're gonna be identification. Are we supposed to broadcast? Like, hey, we're in the rogue. He's in the rogue Olympics. You're in the rogue Olympics. We, we can't fight right now. We gotta fight after. You know, that's a that's an interesting question. Are we allowed to help him? Help him what? Um, Not in the Olympics. No, you're so low. All right, so so the way it works is there's a number of events testing specific skills that a good, good thief needs. Things like how good are uh, you are how good are you at infiltration? How good are you at climbing? How good are you at uh, harming people who are unaware before you attack them? Uh, things like that. The highest scorers in that get entered into a head-to-head -head competition. And the person that comes out of that ahead gets to enter the, uh, gets to enter the vault of Avery Nidax. What if we have a conflict with one, your other representative? Same rules as oh, okay. anything else. What he's saying is, we can't fight a fucking anybody. That's a part of this in the entire charade. I mean, I don't think we'll be a lot anyway. I don't think we'll be I think we'll be all right. Now, entering the vault, in the past, um, winners have been allowed to take their allies with them. But? You know how to get stuff? No. You get, you get one item from the vault. What are the, uh, do you know what the, what he has in his vault? Or is there just like, no, no one knows. Is it like a Sears catalog? No. <laughs> Who the Sky fuck is this guy? What about Sky catalog? Hey. You gonna ask him, like, is he gonna, get a messenger pigeon gonna fucking tell you? This yeah, how are, you, how are you gonna tell me this, uh, this one? Well, we don't really get real specific about when, when the event is. We like to keep those details close to the chest. But what you're gonna wanna do is travel south to the ports. Uh, if you're hanging around the, uh, the area between Shaftport, Old Port, uh, around high summer, they'll find you. You'll make your way to the events. They'll know to look for you. All right. Thanks. Uh huh. One. Uh, you one... said middle of summer. Yeah. What time of the year is it right now? Uh, it was just New Year at the start of the campaign, so. Spring. How long are the seasons? How long, how long is middle of summer? <laughs> <laughs> you have a, a few months. <laughs> you have a few months. But get there when you get there. All right. Next week. <laughs> no one of the Rocky montage of him 
tree. <laughs> you know, when it gets close, which, which we can. Uh, First time. I can cast ceremony on you. We can get married. And your AC can go up plus two. <laughs> <laughs> what do we know we can? You're not marrying him. <laughs> Why not? Why not? Because you never guessed that. <laughs> I mean, it gets, that's not You're saying we can't do it? That's <laughs> not no, I'm saying that's not the way this spell works. You can't fake get married to get a benefit. Whoa. Whoa. So then, would you all this is all imagination. This is all fake. <laughs> like, what, the, what, are we trying to do? what are we trying to do here? Wait a second. So what you're saying is they have to consummate their relationship in order for it to make it official. Yeah, do you want us to oh, rob so figurines? Real marriage. <laughs> What'd you say? I'm saying it has to be a real marriage. I, mean, I know a lot of marriages that aren't fucking real. Tons. Mm -hmm. And those people didn't get plus two AC. I know a nice druid girl married. we can go to. Government says they're married. Yeah, they get plus two on their tax returns. That's <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> so, now pronounce you Cassius and Roland. <laughs> So that's an option. <laughs> <laughs> it only lasts a week. How bad do you want to <laughs> so, so you're gonna have to die. To well, like most marriages. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We just get a honeymoon phase and then it goes downhill from there. <laughs> you can adopt a kobold and uh, exactly ever. Yeah. No, you're not. He's mine. <laughs> or you can marry that deaf girl. He's about to get eaten by a rug anyway. Yeah. Yeah. She's yeah. got a big mouth. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> The girl oh, yeah, the mute, the mute girl. Yeah. Yeah, she's got a big mouth. I'm gonna go home and sleep. Now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, that's it. All right. Well, I guess this is time for a massage. Maybe <laughs> <laughs> you'll meet your wife there. Did we ever do anything with that one um, lich or mage or whoever he was that was at that shop that mm -hmm. we went to? Nope. Oh, that you had the images about? Yeah. Yeah. You told. That dude about it though, didn't you? What were your Shogun? Um, he was the guy that was that was encouraging the wizard who did the weird dragon experiments yes. and the gilded truffle. He was and the gilded truffle people that did the sorrow sworn experiments. He was like the source for that. You know, we didn't kill him. No, we didn't even go to his place after he had that recollection. The 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 fucking image or the wow. vision. The fact that. The fact that you didn't run off, well, that, he's the guy that, <laughs> Not that word. Recollection. <laughs> everybody pauses. She's like, he's just like, he's just like ignore it, ignore it, ignore it. <laughs> he's the, he is the guy that the Shogun is also going after. Okay. okay. Yeah. That's what I was making sure. They said, they said to back off. Probably the reason that you did. you real correctly? Yeah, that's the right. reason you that was my, elected, my recollection. It's because, it's because you you're also aware that he's a magus, so he's like a thousand year old sorcerer. Oh yeah, that fucking guy. Yeah. No, you. Well, we're like twenty five, so. So. All right, so we're a little bit twenty five now. Yes. Right, we got a little bit of time to kill before we go see uh, Uncle Grandpa. Do you want to see how this this mute chick is with your cobalt? We probably can go to this How much money do we have now? Are we? That's a good question. That is a good question. I've really gained a lot since the last time. I feel like we killed a lot of stuff, Ted. Right. Oh, the last one. The last one. We were like 30, 40,000 gold. You kill shit and gold just drops on the floor. I right clicked everybody, Ted. This shit ain't adding up. I know for sure we at least have some fucking grays I can sell. We we at least have 110 plaid pieces. Right. So I know you guys took the last five gold. Uncommon items. Yeah. What's the plan? No. 100, 100 gold pieces? 10. 10 gold pieces, right? <sighs> Would you want to make it 100 gold? We're in the ballpark of like 6k, I believe. How much? Uh, let's go back to our, uh, uh, our Actually, house. More, right? How much? What were we saying we're going to do? We're going to do the fence first. Yeah. yeah. So if you want the wall patched, it was 75. It's double that if you want the wall completely rebuilt by with modern. 7,500? Yes. Yes. The fuck are we hiring? They doing it with gold? No. I say we could get a blanket. What about the progression of, of that mute it's, chick? What did she do so far? Did she learn yet? Nothing. You guys have <laughs> after like. With 200, 200 gold pieces. Yeah. Is the house at least clean? 
You but haven't she, been there. Did she start rebuilding the fence? Let's go. Let's go check no. out her. Yeah, we're gonna go check. Maybe she bought a putty knife. <laughs> <laughs> After all the walls we fucking punch. All right, we'll go check on her. You guys, go back to the house. Yeah. Yeah, yeah she bought. She left? Oh, that's you came with like 200 gold pieces. Do I see her footprints? Yeah, can we track her? No. Yeah. Can I, can we survive I'm a job? master tracker. What about your nose? Cool. You is know there, she it, smells. Is there, is there she does smell. It's bingo. Yeah, I, I put my nose to the, to the air. <sighs> oh, oh, is Bingo still there? Because she was watching Bingo, yeah, She right? didn't take the kid. She kidnapped Bingo? No, she didn't. she didn't. Even worse, she left him there. So he's still there? <laughs> he's not even kidnapped a So the rug's going to eat him? It's bad. The rug's never been dropped off. We just like so no. We rug. just got there. I pulled the rug out of my bag. <laughs> <laughs> no, Bingo sees me and runs to me real quick. And I pick him up. And I'm like, hey, here you go. And I set him on the phone. And he just crawls in my house. You say never touch that rug. No, he didn't. You just threw it on the floor. And I tell him like right in front of the couch. Hey, is that is that weird looking fucking trying to toss a rug on you as a blanket? <laughs> don't don't take it. He's you are not Dobby. You do not take shit from other people. You don't kids take, take a lot of naps. I link with Bongo, do you? Yeah? He can't understand you. <laughs> hey, come here, little boy. Get in the room. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I'm being real date rape by the <laughs> Get in the room. Bingo pees himself. <laughs> I just feel it's warm. I'm just like, what the fuck is going on? And I see the concentrate. I'm just like, stop it. Watch out. Watch out. Roll intimidation. Roll intimidation. just gets that concentrate. <laughs> <laughs> During his mind shit, constipated look. Just like, yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> that bitch took our money and left. You right. think because we were so generous, she'd be like, I'm going to stay with you. So that's cool. You so would think too. Well, if we do find her, we'll just take an eye. I see that dumb bitch. So we'll just kill her. I'm taking her head. How far can somebody that's new fucking get in the goddamn medieval era? Not yeah, yeah. Let's go back to the top of this room. Yeah, <laughs> find this fucking you bitch. Yeah, you bitch. She stole from us. Yeah, she ain't got no tongue. <laughs> just somebody just wave with their hands, trying to get your attention, but couldn't say anything. Yeah. Spending a lot of money. Yeah. She was asking about a new tongue. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we should check the tinkerer. She's like, I saw this asshole with a new hand. Can I get a new tongue? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Well, that was a bust. Yeah. <laughs> I feel the rug over back. Bobby Jr. Bingo, Jr. Dies and says, I guess it's just a fast fish. Like, it's a fast You just managed to know that one is on. No, just like that. Just like that one, dude. Just blow right on Mario, we you had this put like a uh, war graphic content warning child abuse. <laughs> no, it's it's, it's in front of all of our videos. Yeah, yeah. It's a general statement. So we're not monetized. So we're not monetized. Yeah, that's why. Yeah, yeah, that's why. <laughs> yeah. All right. They always boost at the bottom of the page. So we go to the massage parlor. We only have that's one. like that's like. The location of that place is like a quarter of the way from the city you're in now to the cities you need to travel to. Should we stop on the way? We go to the cities that we need to travel to. Get a massage. Oh. Right. Did we want to... I thought we only had a massage for one. No. And a posse. Osh, osh. It Wasn't it just one? No. no. It's, oh, it's, okay. it's, it's, it's one, one and customer the and their retinue. Oh, okay. And it's actually like a full day. Did you? Uh, have you fed that fucking kid of yours? Yeah. That lady was. He's eating garbage, dude. He's just <laughs> yeah, eating garbage. Yeah, he's just eating drywall. He's just eating everything. We got a broken wall. He's been snacking about He's eating drywall. He's peeling my paint off the walls. I'm just, I'm, I don't have to pay for college. college. That bitch was supposed to fucking oh, do it. Make a garden. I bought a place paint down for him. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I told him to say I pick up the place now. I just. Bundle it up, put it in a little ball, and put it in the back. You did not. I still have it. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm going to steal it from him. You can't. Okay. I can't. Slide it in. Okay. You want to? I'm going to steal it. Bingo's watching. Bingo. I feel like he can't slide a hand something the size of a rug, but Bingo's watching you two. I'm wondering if you understand it. If you remember that goblins are actually really, really clever about traps. They're like master trap makers. And you're you're arguing over this plug. And he's like, yeah, that thing's down. I thought he wasn't a goblin. Oh, sorry, not goblins. Cobalt. Cobalt. 
kobolds are experts of. Uh, they also sleep okay. You said you sure. Rock doesn't work. On, on kobolds. Unless he goes and gets on it, like an idiot. Or if he's asleep. Oh. Okay, so come on. Tell Pat to tell him it's the night time. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> so it's not a night, it's night, a roll. Night, it's important to remember. Night, night, but I'm not tired. Night, you will hope you see <laughs> 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 Yeah, we'll put the magic box on it, he can just go to sleep. <laughs> My fingers hurt. <laughs> Your back's gonna hurt. <laughs> the whole landscape will be <laughs> uh, That's me. I'm a hero. All right. So just for a quick one rundown. I did the math. We have uh, 110 platinum pieces. Yep. It sounds like you didn't do the math. Hold on. Hold on. Eleven hundred gold. Eleven hundred gold. We have 4,375 gold pieces. Flat gold pieces. 5,700 silver, which is 570, and then 800 copper, which transitions out to 8 gold pieces. So what's our total? Our total is... <laughs> yes. I did a math here. <laughs> yeah. The math is up with the adding part. Yeah. Like, you don't have enough fingers and fucking toes to do this math. I did reverse I math. Math is, math is more than just listing numbers, kids. 6,000. Not enough. Is there a bank? Can you pay an installment plan? I mean, yeah, you can you can go try to you go to the casino. Oh, like for your no, rolls, yeah, they offered you that. They said you pay them half up front and they'll get started. I'm thinking like a quarter up front. Yeah, they're not doing that. Okay. Actually, nope. Do they have casinos around here? Not really. I totally triple that money. They do. You throw it all in black? Yeah. Good to go. Double it. Green. 10 to 1 ounce. <laughs> I like this. is a great idea. I'm excited. No. Uh, since I can't get into any type of conflict uh, uh, for the next several months, should we go apologize to Shogun? No, you just can't no, get into conflict with, with, with other people in the competition. Yeah. While the competition's going on? Like, yeah. you could totally let like the, the rug eat bigger. No. 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 no, it's not no conflict at all. It's it's boring you can't episodes. you can't go attack the guy from the other guild to take him out of competition. But can you hire people to go? As long as you don't get caught, sure. Wink, wink. We're very smart. Don't look at that word. Yeah. History has shown. So we are geniuses, right? So you want to go to that that shopkeeper's place? Yeah, go back to the shopkeeper. See what he's got to trade. No, no, no. Oh, no, we oh, talk about the, with the lich. The Magus? The, the Magus. Yeah, no, uh, yeah, let's go back to... Uh, you, don't know if, you don't know if he knows that you're a bad guy. Or he, you don't know if he knows that you know that he's a bad guy. What? Bad. So you We don't know that... You're, That's what you're, I not, sure, you're not sure if he knows. That you know <laughs> that he knows that he knows. We, we know. we know that he's a bad guy that knows that we're not bad guys. Right, right. And right. I know he knows. <laughs> Did you know? Don't <laughs> bother yeah. oh, me. Ooh, Let's go back to uh, Uncle Duck. We'll see what. These uh... guys go in, shut the shop up. Uh, Grandpa Knuckles, Grandfather Knuckles comes back from behind the. From the, the little back room, he's got something wrapped up in a heavy like bear fur. He drops it on the uh, drops it on his counter, and you hear this thunk sound. Uh, and he unties these leather thongs and like uh, pushes the the bear skin back. <laughs> what do you get a sex swing? And you see <laughs> you see a single you see a single bladed bearded axe with a, with the. Uh, this, the spiked hook thing on the back, uh, sitting there, and it appears to be just a single piece of steel. It doesn't have a wooden handle or anything. There's no runes on it. No, yeah. no anything. It just it looks like a very very plain battle axe. So, Uncle Grandpa, I have a. Scimitar? No, you already got rid of that. Rage here. I have, I have the Rage here mm-hmm. that is made out of like an unknown alloy mm-hmm. with smokiness. Pretty sure it's Star. 
a couple uh, of except a couple of ability. And you want to trade for just that plain looking bearded bad boy? <laughs> it's all more than just appearance. Well, what is it? It's this. This is Star Wars Wrath. Oh. It's sleeping right now, but given time, you can possibly awaken it. Till then, it's completely useless. Well, it, 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 all right, even asleep, this is a dangerous weapon. Now, for reference, what are we looking at? Uh, so, so if there was such a thing as an internet and you had KDI, Thank you. you'd be looking for a Dragon's Wrath weapon. The slumbering category. So is it like alive? No. It's it's infused with the spiritual essence of a dragon because it was in their horde for such a long time that their magical power was infused into it. Ooh. Yeah, bingo paint it for you or something. <laughs> yeah, what is <it's> good? Nothing. <laughs> Dragon's wrath. Right. 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 That way you get poison damage. For some reason, I actually want to tell you that. Well, apparently you don't get it. Yeah, I guess it's not a thing. Yeah. 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 One <laughs> battle axe. <laughs> so, the slumbering version of it, and aside from being a aside from being a magic weapon, so roll five s damage resistance is uh, whenever you roll a natural twenty on an attack roll with it. Every, you can choose as many creatures as you want that are within five feet of you, and they will take five damage of the weapon's elemental tone. So, so, so every time you crit, you can also uh, choose as many of the creatures adjacent to you as you want, and do five fire damage. Oh, you, so you have a cleave. And this is, yeah. But this, this is the slumbering version. It awakens over time if you fulfill certain criteria. And it'll awaken to what rarity? Uh, in theory, it can awaken all the way up. Too common. You know what? Fuck it. Yes. Is that the dragon's wrath weapon? Is that what mm-hmm. you said? Yeah. Yep, right there. All right. So he gives you, he said, uh, hit load more a couple times. Just type in dragon. <laughs> no. Not see this man, let me go back. Dragon. Turn your face. Shut me Slumbering. Dragon. Are you trying to do like. Trying to find it under the No, I was wondering if Gage was trying to do like uh, the Space Pants song. But, uh, I just searched for it. Yeah, you fucking typed the, the words in. It's right there. It's right there. Right there. The letters go in a certain order. In the order. Three natural Go to inventory. You probably didn't drag it. You probably didn't have the uh, thing for it. Uh, all my stuff is shared, so. It's, yeah. You're doing stuff, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Obviously. Tech guy. Call, it's called Dragon, right? Call the number at the bottom of the website. Yeah, there's no. Right, my balls all over your fucking. It's not. It's not Dragoon. <laughs> <laughs> Was that homework on that? No. Nope. Sucks to you. I guess you don't get it. You just had a regular battle. Like what books are targeting? Dragon's Wrath weapon. It's fucking slumbering right there. Yeah, I got it too. Except that one's a long sword. Do I have to actually go in and make this stupid thing? I think I'm going to have to go ahead and make this stupid thing. Yeah, this stupid thing. Yeah. Although, actually, a long sword and a battle axe have the same actual statistics. That's what I did last time with, I'll the, just with my axe. Can't find it. It's mine now. I can use it too. Yep. Joke's on you, it's mine. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Joke's on you. I don't think we, we voted that you can have it. Yeah. Uh, you can't fucking take this rapier from me, so guess what, Mr. One Hand? I don't give a fuck what you say. All right, rocket punch. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to rocket punch his vulnerable spot, his uh, udders. Uh, there you go, Dennis. Now you have it. Refresh your character sheet. Yeah, it's in your inventory Jeez. now. Jeez. Said tanks, Teddy. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So as you pick it up, you can feel there's like a pulsing warmth. It feels like it's been sitting near a fire. It's just dormant. It just pulses. Just dropping. Just dropping. It's swirling. When it awakens, (laughs) 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 (laughs)
Oh, well. <laughs> <laughs> back to shake weights. Is that what this is? Yup, yup. <laughs> in your mind, you think you could put it in your butt. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I, I appreciate it. Oh, okay. <laughs> resolved everything unless you want to go pick a fight with the Magus that you have around town right now. Got a new axe that's slumbering. Wake up. You can uh, go look for look for trouble or you can head down start heading heading on down south and take your good sweet time getting there. Let's look for trouble. <laughs> Do we want to pay uh, to get our fence mended or we got it? We're enough. You can do halves. You can do half. And they'll start on it. But we want to keep our gold in case we come across something. Is this what you need any gear before we leave this area? Just keep our gold. Mm. I mean, does anybody want to upgrade armor, shields, weapons? Gage, um, what kind of armor do you wear? Uh, this one I'm looking right now. I mean, I only have studded leather. But you're a ranger. That's yeah. what I'm trying. I have half plate right now. So you definitely have enough to upgrade to plate if you want. Is there any good? And I still have scale mail. Oh no, you can't no. do you can't do play. I you're, can't. Uh, yeah, you're, uh, great player. Yeah, you're not proficient. I uh, I still have scale mail. We can sell off too. And my half plate armor is from uh, my dwarvish people. What's the highest medium armor that's not metal? Yeah, hide. Oh, that's not metal. Yeah. Hide. Do you really want to buy? Stuff for a character that uh, <laughs> you could you could find some people that, that know what they're doing to get non-metal armor made out of something else, but you'd have to travel like north to the elves, who can make who have uh, special kinds of wood. I give me special kind of wood. I got. Mm-hmm. I'll treat you. Mm-hmm. My last character didn't like it. Everything, <laughs> everything goes around in dicks in this area. It does. So you can, yeah, you can travel, you can travel a few weeks north up to the Elvenwood, uh, Forest of Summer and Dreams, which is where you came from, uh, and try to get them to craft you some, like, half plate out of uh, Ironwood or something. Mm. Interesting. How much would that cost? It's half what it costs. It would be adorable too. What is that? Uh, 1500 No, that's plain. It would be, it would 750? be based on, $750? It would be based on the cost of half of it. Alright, whatever. Why don't we travel that area? We might swing by. What do you wear? Well, you're going, you're going the other way. Huh? Studded. Studded. Are you proficient in heavy armor or no? No, uh, rangers are proficient in light and medium, but uh, if you max out dex, it's not usually worth getting medium armor. Uh, what are you at, 18 right now? Yep. Who's there? Alright, so do we want to go south or do we want to Try picking a fight with this thousand-year-old lingering 
Oh, we gotta get out of that fight. Maybe he's got some cool shit. I don't think you can handle that fight yet, dude. Magnus? You know, Magnus? Because the guy told me to stay away. He's a thousand years old. Everybody tells us to stay away. Old fart. Got a magic Look, axe now. All right. Roll yeah. D twenty in there. If uh, the so high roll is so ordinary half plate will cost you seven fifty, which means if you want to go up north and get the elves to craft you some, it'll cost all fifteen hundred gold. How long does it take though? For him to get a few days, and it's a few weeks to get up there. Yeah. So we're doing so much money. Eleven or higher. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> he has I, I want my membership fee. They're pretty high right now. <laughs> You haven't even paid taxes on the house yet. That's a review. It's not mine. Yeah. Um, I mean, I can pay taxes on the house. Eleven or higher maggots, one to ten we go south. Yeah. Down, down. What is it? Twelve. All right. I guess we're going against the maggots. Well, we're going to die. Everyone got new characters? My dad. Bingo Junior. <laughs> I'm kind of hoping for that. Me too. I mean, they're gonna. Are you fucking serious right now? Try the other way, fool. Oh, it's Cage. Does he watch the one year old play with fucking Legos? <laughs> Give me a second. <laughs> so, you guys are gonna go. Uh, you guys are gonna go uh, try to shake down the Magus? I mean, that's what the site said. I, I didn't agree with it, but whatever. We're, we're gonna die. Yeah, it's, the show got literally told us stay away from this guy. Who we'll fucked you up? The show we showed up. up. Alright, then we'll go south. I don't give a fuck. Do we go against the dice? We're cool. Everybody rolls. I'm down with that. Head the other way. <laughs> <laughs> he literally said, "Stay away from this guy." People are supposed to stay away from shit all the time. When's this up? All right, I'm all starting. Time. I'm starting to go south. <laughs> so all the time it stops. Us, is dude. it three with my one? holy symbol, dude? I'm just, I'm just shining by myself. Is it three against two right now? Yep. I'm going. Right. I'm going south. God forbid. Well, no, the dice voted. It's actually three against three. Is the well, dice? My Drake's vote. He, he votes for Bingo. What does Bingo, oh, what yes, is Bingo vote? Bingo wants to go see the Vegas. Yeah. yeah. He's going to eat my rug, so his vote won't come. So see. Who is it? Mario, put the top back on. <laughs> you can do it twice. This is why they always want to murder your child, guys. Um, I guess the tiebreaker is we gotta go find the mute bitch and then uh, she decides <laughs> <laughs> and kill her. <laughs> kill her. <laughs> What's your vote? Yeah, right, we're, so we're, we're, we're in the market district, right? Yeah, I, yeah. Ted, I talked about criminal con- contacts. I want to know where the, uh, this chick went. All right. It's probably not hard to find. So you spent a few hours asking around about where the uh, where the mute. Woman went and uh, you find her in a game of gummies. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't even care if she didn't free the sauce yet. Yes, I'm gonna say she's got teeth, she's just a mute. Yeah, the, it's, 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 it's a half on. slap blowy. <laughs> <laughs> just a whole lot of spit. <laughs> it's just a gaping hole. <laughs> Uh, this is why we don't have viewers. <laughs> this is why we don't have viewers. <laughs> now this is how we're gonna get viewers. All the all the people that watch all the other streams and are like, you know what? I wish I wish this show had more idiots making thirteen year old locker room jokes. Uh, welcome to our world. All right, you find anything about her? Yeah, you find out that uh, she was. Um, Headed out of town, she had stopped and bought a few things, but she actually got uh, grabbed up, and word on the street is that she was taken by uh, some of the um, matches. No, they're like they're like uh, six shepherds. No cartel, Goblins. mafia. Uh, uh, yes. Guards? 
Yeah. Oh my God! Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> Aliens. <laughs> Ninjas. She got nabbed up by uh, like a, a, a cult group that uh, rehabilitates oh. people. Oh, people with no tongues. Scientologists. They go to those yeah, kind of. <laughs> oh, fucker. And Dude, they, whatever. They think they uh, supposedly they're they're somewhere down south. Oh. Well, maybe in the meantime, we we very convenient. (laughs) Oh, he's guiding us. (laughs) No, you guys want to go north and buy armor? Go in. I'm going to go south and look for this cult so I can save this mute bitch again. No, we're not saving her. You want to go? You want to go east and wander into the red shadow? That's cool too. Uh, I would like to go east. Yeah, let's go to the front lines where the where the real wars going on right now. Yeah, we level up real quick. Is there? Before we head outside, is there like a way I could research what would help awaken the blade? Yeah. No, somewhere you know, the armor. And the you remember once upon a time you had a wizard? All that information would be was barely the fall all party. that information would be in the in the uh, Tower of Wizardry that only oh, wizards have access to. Yeah, it's just trial and error, dude. Just start killing shit with it. Start killing shit. Your first crit, you'll figure it out. It's not gonna happen tonight. Probably waking up really quick. What? A sacrifice. Of your first death. <laughs> of a dragon fin. Oh. Yeah, maybe that's what it is. Maybe it needs to be awakened by right. dragon fin. Maybe sacrifice a sleeping rogue. I don't know. Uh, you can't. I have a passive perception too high. That, that, that's not what that means. You see that? You see that? Whatever the whole Star Wars movie is, where he tries to kill the kid in his sleep. Yeah. Whatever you're asleep, I'll I'll, I'll, I'll stone review. Go ahead. Go look over there. I don't look at the, the look at the bar. What's the problem now? Somebody donated us five thousand dollars. Yeah. We Underneath the mouse. What go does look. it say? Go look. Oh, never mind. Underneath the mouse. Okay, Gage, get up and go look. No, there's nothing there. Oh. Did Sunflower look back? Bango said, hey, Sunflower. I saw her. She, I see her as a user. Oh, okay. Uh, Mad Max. Oh, so, Mad Max, Max so wait, just follow. There you go. Thanks, Mad Max. Thank you. Thank you. Took a second. Boy, did you come in a bad day, though. These guys are idiots. <laughs> All right, so let's head yeah. south. Do we, do we need anything to we, we head out? Campaign on morning something? Do we have potions? We got all the good stuff. We got potions. You guys upgraded on armor. Yes, yeah. set. We're ready. All right. So you hit the road on down south, uh, and I'm like your first day out of travel. You start to realize there's a lot of uh, traffic out on the road, uh, moving in both directions. And uh, kind of ask around a little bit as you're passing one of these other uh, parties going by and you find out that uh, there's a rumor that uh, a, a port city to the east of Shathport and Old Port called Salt Marsh got obliterated by an army of the dead. And so a lot of people are uh, trying to either flee from the southern ports or they're heading down there to, to try to uh, build better defenses and defend it. They're he- heading to Southport? Yeah. Yeah. Which is where we're going anyway? You're, you're headed to the direction of Shathport and Old Port. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'd like to keep my eyes open and see if I see anybody twice. Walking to see if like people are following us or. I mean, you're traveling at roughly the same pace as a lot of other people. You can see a lot of the same people. Um, I will say you can make an insight check to see if you think anyone's paying particular attention to you. I'm professional. I'll help you. Uh, yeah, can you give me time to do something else right now? Unnatural point. Yeah, so you definitely notice that uh, there are some people that are kind of keeping an eye on you guys, but uh, the longer you kind of keep an eye on them and pay attention to your lives, it's just because you guys have actually started to build up a reputation. People know who you are. Uh, a lot of people are, if anything, kind of 
giving you guys a wide berth and trying to stay not not getting your way. Yeah, yeah put put uh, put some respect on. Yeah. <laughs> respect. Right. So just just to show you guys, reiterate if anyone ever actually watches this episode, you guys are you guys were up here in Old Darren Yard. Yep. This is where you've been. Kabe is where you guys uh, went up, and that's where the plague the uh, the plague was was hitting the uh, the refugee camp. Up here, that's the Forest of Slumbering G- Dreams. That's where your new druid would have come south from. Oh, you should have bought armor while you were up there, motherfucker. Yeah, that's the fun. Uh, this is the Darren River that flows north and south. Hence the Darren Guard uh, is the fort on the river. The mountains that you guys went into were, would be over here. Now you're traveling south along the, along the old Imperial Highway, or what's left of it. Toward the south, uh, these are Shathport and Oldport, and way over there is Saltmarsh. Wow. That's where the Undead Armor just said. Yep. And everybody's going to these two. Where's the war going on right now? The defenses? You see where you see where it's a, a orangish blotch? Yeah. This? That's where that's where the Necromancer's army is spreading out. From. Okay. I feel like we did. I think we're ready. So in that area over there where you have see the uh, incredibly creatively named the city, that's the bar that's the the barbarian. That's where the uh, that's where the uh, uh, nomadic tribes live, um, and the reason this city doesn't have a name is because the barbarians believe that if you name something, it means you own it, and they see cities as like a sign of, of the weakness of of uh, civilized men. And so, while they built the city as a trade hub, they refuse to name it because no one wants to own it. So if you call it the city, is that the name? Shut up. Mm-hmm. They don't have a great education system. This is this is the front line right here. And you know what? That's that's a noun too. I mean, it's, it's a place. Also a thing. Does that mean he can animate it with animated objects? Yeah, yeah, I, I, I mean, the necromancer's animating the fucking cities in Saltmarsh right now. So I mean, yeah. he's animating dead people. But it still fucking counts. Too. See, add to the list of shit you're wrong about. I'm just thinking, pure profit. Those dead people probably got. Buried with their rings and their jewelry. And I mean, they're probably just walking around. So every time you slice a ground bubble, you just take one of them. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh, you guys think that, that, that ordinary people just have a ton of wealth on them, do you? Well, no, but if you kill enough uh, people, at least I know a mute that's got 200 gold. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a recent thing because some people were just like, you're going to give me this chick. I mean, if you kill enough people, we hope she would stay start, around. We'll start being the crew. Well, we'll push Hmm. Went in, you the right. Yeah, I, I feel like they did it a little, little bit differently than you're suggesting, but well, anyway. So as you guys are, you know, you keep Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> what? You didn't know, did you? <laughs> You History Bill, books are wrong. Did you go to Bill and Ted's high school? Is that what, <laughs> yeah. That what, what kind of bumpkin stuff are you talking about right now, dude, from the fucking the woods? It's nice uh, to have friends. <laughs> you only see us every month. Where are they? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. oh, you mean your renter's fee. <laughs> <laughs> so after after a few days of travel, you start recognizing things from the map, the little map right there. Neuralize, uh, and in another couple of days, you're going to reach the temple of the rest of the world. Um, I do need everyone to give me a constitution save. That's an extra 20. My Cartman died. Cartman saved your ass. Yep. Do I plus 5 con? Fuck no. <laughs> I got plus 6, I still rolled a 9. Oh, you guys suck at this. <laughs> 13. 13? So fail. Thirteen. You rolled ten too. Yeah, I think so. He failed. We're getting me a laptop so we can have more than we've got. In this big. Three other laptops in this house. <laughs> <laughs> All right. No. no that's not, that's not, <laughs> so everybody, everybody except when Warren, uh, when you go, when you lay down to rest. You just, you have like weird nightmares and everything, and uh, I thought that's usual. What the hell is your cleric's name? 
Cassius? Cassius. Yeah. Cassius would definitely recognize it as uh, you're being influenced by negative energy. Uh, so those of you that fail, you, your hit point max is reduced by five and you have a level of exhaustion. You know, uh, Cassius can tell you that you're, you're literally being drained by necrotic energy as you're drawing closer to the red shadow. So we need positive thoughts and vibes right now. Yes, and, and crystals. Not crystal math. So disadvantages on saving throws? No. No, the first level of exhaustion is like... Skill checks. Ability checks. Ability checks. So basically skill checks. Yuck. What the hell was that? Thank you, J.D. Miller. For turned, him. turned out Nick Rupp got it. <laughs> Screw you, oh, Nick! Nick. <laughs> isn't, he at, isn't he at slower donkeys or whatever? Yeah. yeah. They're not going until tomorrow. It's just no one his girlfriend today. Uh, if the camper is a rock and don't come on rocky. Yeah. You want to grab babies, right? <laughs> not yet. <laughs> <laughs> So, the best gifts are those that are unplanned. Yeah. Who told you that? A Grampy! What's <laughs> up? So, What's so up, Uncle Grandpa? Yeah, show, show him what we'll do to that. Little Bingo Junior. <laughs> <laughs> it's like that. Yeah. Oh, you're right! Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. You can't even take one. Oh, fuck. I don't want to leave the house. Oh. Don't have fun with us. So, yeah. Uh, you're starting to feel, like, uh, just drained and everything. Get up for the get up for your, your second day of, or your, not your second day, it would be actually your fourth day of travel, but you're one day out from the temple. And you start noticing that the other people, other people traveling in this area also seem to be suffering similar effects. God berries. Yeah, you're good berries. God berries. Look at the fucking name of the skill. G O D B E R R Y. What? Berry. It's good berries. Good berries. Spell with one O. Spell with two. Do they or no? No. I got goo berries. Not good berries. <laughs> <laughs> he he went to the Al to the Aldi. Oh yeah. He wanted yeah. Like, the Captain Crunch. The Aldi Druid store. Okay. You want to get much, but they had. All right. Uh, all right. So we keep what does this working. terrain look like that we're traveling around? Uh, now you're on a road, like so. To your, uh, to the west of you, there's a mountain range. There's a river running right by the road. Why are you having Huckleberry Finn this shit? Pretty much an open plain. Why aren't you on a, a like a boat or a raft? A raft yeah. That would cost money. It would have sped up our time, wouldn't it have? Oh, yeah. Well, not really, because the river actually flows... North? Yeah. The oh. river flows the other way. So with exhaustion, wouldn't we just... Wouldn't we not be exhausted anymore after we finish water, after we rest over No, that's the point, is you, you didn't get a proper oh, okay. long rest. Okay. So, all right. I need everyone to make another DC-15 Constitution save. Oh, all right, I'm here. 17. Fuck, I failed. Oh, yes. 20. <laughs> he failed too. Nope. No girl this? No. Yeah. 18 out of the way. Okay, so for, uh, for those of you that failed, Mario, you have your, so max you HP, too? your max HP is reduced by another 5. And you have another level of exhaustion, which I believe is half speed. Well, I can't move fast anyway. Yeah, you move like five now, man. Okay. Twelve. You have ten feet every six seconds. Mm, no, twelve point two five, or twelve point five. <laughs> if he sprints, he can go twenty feet in six seconds. Oh, that's no, is there any way I can twenty five feet? Back in us in this way. I told you it was a back in you. The, what the, what was your question? Energy? Like, do we have any way to combat? Like, would I know any way to combat that? Or? Yeah, a good night's rest, dude. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, the sport. old sleep. <laughs> not, having your, not having your life drained by the crowd. Yeah, you gotta close them eyes, dude. So, 
What are these? What are these magic items or weapons you have? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. oh. I told you I gave him some magic items. Is there any way we can identify where the source wall is coming from? Yeah, it's coming it's from the war. Uh, coming from the the red shadow. Yeah, the war that we're passing. We're passing through. Yeah. Exactly. I don't know we passed into the red shadow. No, we're passing the border. No, you're just too close to it. If you were in it, it would be worse. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's why we gotta look up. We oh, can't no. dim them down. Good. No, you can't dim them down. You have to put them back the way they were. Yep, there you we're go. We're good now. What happens if you dim them down? Can't see you. Can't see, can't see you. I'm okay with that. I'm the invisible DM. <laughs> <laughs> the sound of that. That wasn't boner or anything. No, nobody did. Was it boner? What? We're talking about boners. 13-year-old boner. How are you rolling, Corey? What did we roll? You succeeded. Uh, 18. Okay. All right, so uh, you guys and know you guys, that... You guys have two levels of exhaustion now? I do. Toward, do. The end of your, toward, toward the end of your fourth day of travel, you do know that if you push out about another couple hours, it'll be the middle of the night, but you'll be, you can reach the Temple of the Restful World. Let's do it. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah. Is that like a like a cleric temple, or is that the massage that's place? It's a massage yeah. place. Yeah, that's the that's the uh, the spa. Is there a temple? They call it the temple of the restful little. You kind of think it's not really a temple. No, is there a temple in that that city? It's not a city. Oh, it's just. It's, a uh, temple, it's just it's a not brothel. A Duh. It, it's, it's a bathhouse. Almost definitely it's not side a of the fucking road. Oh. That's all it is. Yeah. The Russian bathhouse. Yeah. I like pray the trap. trap. Look, you can pray. You can pray. You can do a lot of stuff in a lot of ways. This is the only place you can be handy. You can get if you pay the, <laughs> if you pay the girls enough. Oh fuck it! Wow. Yeah. Fuck it, dude. Let's just go in the middle of the night. Is our coupon good for the middle of the night? Our coupon? It doesn't say like use between. Sun is it sun? like blood stained? Is it a blood stained coupon? It is actually. It is. Yeah. I clean. Yeah, like, you, you what do you got? A tide pen? You got price the digitation. Yeah, what do you got? A fucking tide pen over there? <laughs> yeah, you gotta soak it in your. your uh, uh, Gage, I believe they don't buy tide pods because they're a pretty one. It was a challenge. I shit bubbles for 10 minutes. Yeah, so we'll push on to the Tiger Lily and. I never had to Almost. <laughs> All the shit that you did, we just fucking go a totally different way. I don't think I got it right. No, we're never going to get it right. Uncle Grandpa. Uncle Grandpa, Tiger Lily. So you make your way. Thanks, uh, it's actually quite a ways off the road. It's not someplace they just want, like, ordinary folk without good coin to spend wandering into. Uh, but as you approach, you see that it's... it's uh, the, the main building is a large white structure. It's painted white uh, with columns in the front, a large porch. Looks like, basically looks like a big fancy house. But then there's a couple of outbuildings, including uh, one that's all stone and one that's almost like a windmill, but it doesn't have a, uh, a windmill. This is a tower? <laughs> Yeah, it's like a it's like a wooden tower with the the cone shaped head, but it doesn't have any. Uh, like a kind of. Or what are those like uh, things on the farm? Silos. Silos. It's like the penis. Yeah. Building it's kind of like silo. It's, it's kind of like silo, but much larger. <laughs> but deja vu. Uh, but you don't see any. Like nobody comes out to greet you or anything as you approach. This is like a VIP place. Yeah. And we are cool. VIPs. No, what are we considered? Are we considered like middle class? Depends on how much money you spend on your living every month. Oh, no class. I spend a lot on French. We're hobos. <laughs> we're not we hobos. A we're vagrants. So you enter enter oh, into the so adventures. <laughs> <laughs> you enter through the front front doors and you see that there's like a little reception area. There's a long white marble desk. Is the usual working behind the desk? No. There's a long white marble desk. Uh, there's a uh, bunch of paintings of like serene, uh, you know, uh, big fields and forests and 
uh, seascapes, but it's all very peaceful and everything. There's music filtering in here from the somewhere. It sounds like uh, like elevator music, like super white, uh, almost background noise type flute music. And uh, there's a couple of long couches, uh, and uh, nobody's behind the nobody's behind the desk. But you do see there's a, a halfling sleeping on one of the couches. I'll go wake him up. I'll poke him with my staff. So you walk up and poke at the halfling. And he lifts his head and opens his eyes and goes, hey, oh, uh, uh, are you, uh, are you, you can't stay here for free. Are you, if you're not customers, you need to leave. Just walk in my hand and move up. He takes it and goes, oh, oh, I apologize. You're very important customers. Yeah. My name is Lester. Wouldn't we have like five hole, hole punches on here or something like that on our coupon? Yeah, then we go, is this one free or something? Yeah. Is that how he knows that we're like important customers? No, it's because you got the, the free, the invite for the free stay. You must be important. Yep. Yeah. Five of your best rooms. Oh, uh, well, that's that's not exactly how, how things work here. Why don't you tell me how it works? <laughs> Hold on. He dashes over. He dashes over to the white counter and opens up a little door and walks underneath the counter. Goes around. You hear him dragging his stool. Climbs up. Sits on the stool. Takes out this massive book. All right, Matt Mercer. Pulls <laughs> Pulls out a pulls out a, a quill, dips it in his ink, and says, "I'm going to need your names." Uh, I am also Lester the Molester. He writes Lester the. It won't take that name, sir. Oh, that name's already been taken. <laughs> <laughs> you can That's see that as he writes, it was like disappearing. The ink was like disappearing. Lester the Molester one. <laughs> what do you need our names for? <laughs> oh, uh, well, the healing spirits. Of this ancient shrine uh, need uh, a form of resonance. Your name is the first level of resonance we require. Can I roll insight? No, you shouldn't, because you have exhaustion. You should. I have exhaustion too. You would have disadvantage. Yeah. Judging by the first face. My name's Bongo. It's Bongo. And it, it appears, and then you see when he's done writing, he goes, Come on, and then it says, Baronet appears on the thing. And he looks up and goes, Oh, Baronet, it's been a while since we've had land of gentry. Yes, 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 yes. thank you. So I, I, take it, I take it you're the, the leader of this illustration. Oh, yes, yes, yes. yes, yes. Of course, of course. Very, very much. I, I'm next. Yes. High Priestess. 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 <laughs> High Priestess. High Priestess. He writes. He writes, High Priest Cassius. Oh, Priestess. Is that Priestess? He writes, High Priest Cassius. <laughs> priestess. That's what he said. Tyrael. Yeah, no big deal. What's your what's your rank in title? Stargazer. Bumpkin Stargazer? <laughs> bumpkin. Did it take Bumpkin? No. <laughs> the title disappears. Uh, the, 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 the good elf, whatever the fuck he is over here, this is uh, a human. Good war. You're a human? Right. Yep. Whatever. And, and Roland. And you? I don't see race. Later in the story, we find out he's, at, he's actually his father. Runs it in. Uh, and now once he's got all the names in, right. you see that uh, you see that the, the ink on the paper turns like a, a, a real gentle green color. And he goes, all right, well, uh, before you can occupy any of the rooms, you, you will need to, to clean up. Um, the bath is that the, the, the stone building with the column, columns outside. So once you've cleansed yourselves, then we'll have a room ready for each other. Real quick, we need to add a 16 to this. Uh, this is uh, Bingo Jr. Hmm. I still almost, start to fall oh, right. <laughs> He looks, he goes, oh, I'm sorry, sir. We don't allow children in there. Do you have a date? He's a preteen. He's, he's a preteen. Give him that magic carpet and he can fly at home. <laughs> he's, he's earning his manhood today. He writes and goes, accepted the name very well. Thank you. 
Don't yeah. listen to my peasant rogue. Good job. Is he standing on the rugs? Just go make sure you're go make sure you're all very clean and and uh and when you feel like we're gonna get sacrificed. When you return, uh, I'll, I'll have rooms ready for you. I feel like our shit is stolen. Fuck it. Okay. I start running towards the bathhouse. <laughs> Well, you're not really moving. And I, I hurry up. I hurry up. I get down, and I and I just cannonball in. The rest of us just walk fast, and we keep up with them. So yeah. you you drop all your clothes and you cannonball into uh, this giant scorching hot water with like steam rising all over it. You see, there's an attendant standing there. There's an elf, and he just watches you run past naked and jump into the water. And as you go back, he goes, Towson. And I'm like, I'm like, oh, and I'm like getting my dreads out and I'm like flicking my dreads around and everything like that because they're all, I'm like just. All right, go, Derek. <laughs> Tone it down. It's, it's, different it's, different I don't it, it's just dark <laughs> now. <laughs> the water is just dark. <laughs> you just see filth. I just want to go to a different The water is scented heavily of like eucalyptus. You know, I still have disadvantage in all my checks. He goes, he, uh, the, the uh, attendant is standing there. The tall, lean, high elf. He's got, a, you know, towels over his arm, well-dressed. And as you guys, as you guys come in, he says, uh, we do require that all guests uh, remove all clothing before entering the, entering the, the bath. The water dirty now. <laughs> It's oh, I, I assure you, it, it's uh, quite hot enough to. It grows clean. And they see me doing backstrokes, and I'm just spitting up water. <laughs> Dirty water. He says, Could you inform me from that it, it is not, in fact, a pool? <laughs> Everything's a pool if you're this small. Oneself? We'll let him know. He's slow. And I'm yelling, I'm like, Come on in! <laughs> your, clothes, your clothes and equipment will be taken for cleaning, of course. Oh. You'll find them. You'll find them all in all of your belongings in your room. We, if, if we robbed our guests, we wouldn't have the sterling reputation. Well, you do an insight check. I didn't, I didn't see your yeah. review. Do an insight check, Bingo. Yeah. Bingo, do an insight check. So you just flat. I'll flat roll. Just so he, right? What's that? Flat roll. You didn't. You didn't. Yeah. You didn't fail an exhaustion check. Still a nineteen. It wasn't a twenty. Yeah, you don't you don't get any impression that he's like bullshitting you. Like he's he's legitimately more concerned about not being seen as a thief. I strip down than about tricking you. You do my shit. I'm just watching. You want to take the old man's staff, right? Oh, uh, I am afraid that we can't allow. Uh, anything that hasn't been cleansed to pass beyond the uh, the uh, vestry, not the vestry, the uh, foyer of the main house. This is a place of, of deep spiritual healing. What? Learned doctors. It's a house of learned, learned doctors. doctors. You guys get in or what? All right. I uh, understand you had a learned doctor, but you let him die. I feel like if he would have killed the thing that killed him a little faster, he'd still be alive. Well, I mean, that's that's true just because it is. Yes. All right. So you, you guys see a couple of you guys see a couple of uh, halflings come in and take all your gear and they make sure they put it into like separate boxes so everyone stays with their. Uh, yeah, the, the elf is looking at your drink like uh, he's very confused how a pet got in here. <laughs> while uh, while we're, we're uh, while I'm swimming, right? I dive under, and they can't see me anymore, and everything like that, because the mist and everything like that. And I get right behind Bongo, and I I rocket punch a big wave towards them. How do they take that? <laughs> how do, how does how does the, the, the how wet does it get? Can I, can I grapple the cleric? <laughs> does Bingo do whatever you want? I'm gonna grapple the cleric. Yeah, two a naked minotaur and a naked the, dwarf. Uh, you need the unarmed fighting style for fighting styles. For 
armor fighter. You know, you're a fighting style, so yeah. two armor fighting. Yeah. Unarmed fighting style, uh, all your unarmed strikes do like a d6 or whatever, or a d8 if you're not weapon. But more importantly, if you grapple someone, you automatically do d4 damage at the start oh, of the yeah. game. I was like, that's the Dennis Chokehold maneuver. Yeah, that's what it's fucking chill, man. Alright, I get the water. Alright, I don't know what's going on. I stay the fuck away from him. So, you guys immediately all. So those of you that have any will lose a level of exhaustion. And your hit point max goes back up by five. I feel like I should nice. get advantage or something. Don't you guys? You feel very, very relaxed. You do notice that like the dirt in the pool seems to be going somewhere. Like it doesn't stay very long. The water gets clean again. Maybe there's like a monster that, that, that feeds on give the water. Give it five the, seconds the and the cleric will find the holes where all of this is being cleansed from and filtered and he'll put something in the hole. Are we talking about his penis again? Yes, we're talking about his penis. Who it sucks. If he's got a hole, he'll <laughs> fuck it. I just want you to know. That's why I put his fear of annihilation in there. All, off, then we all holes are right mimics. It's not <laughs> <a> Jet's a mimic. <laughs> uh, so you're yeah. in, in the water? Yeah. He's right. He, bingo with you? He's right next to me. He's on my shoulder. Oh. Bingo is, bingo is just sitting in the water, like, completely unbothered by how hot it is. He's like, I bring my Drake over to clean water. Yeah, yeah, take care of it. It's a pet, bro. Yeah, I know. Yeah. That Drake's like that's why I tell people that's super cool. I'll read in the water. It's not real. You shut your dirty boy. <laughs> He's a, he, You're not real. Yeah. Neither is your character. <laughs> <laughs> we'll kill off your next fucking character too. <laughs> Just fucking wait. Um, so you notice that they took your stuff, when they took your stuff, they went back, they didn't go out the front door when you guys came in, they went back into, like, a, a further back part of the bathhouse. Um, but yeah, you get, you get clean, you feel somewhat reinvigorated, uh, after, after a while, the, uh... You couldn't find a bathhouse now? No. Well, I actually do that. I have one, but you don't need it right now. Uh, <laughs> right now, right. weird. <laughs> he, the attendant, the go. attendant comes and he has like these heavy, thick fur uh, robes, and he's like, oh, "Whenever you're ready, you may uh, return to your rooms. Your items have been cleaned and placed there for you. Uh, feel free to make an inventory. And be sure that all of your belongings." Uh, have been uh, accounted for, and um, enjoy the rest of your stay. All right, I get out. Thank you, sir. Fuck, what do you? I, I get out. I grapple with Claire. And, I, I, and I, I walk. I walk in front of him. I turn behind, and I put my arms out like a child, like getting ready to get. B to sixteen. You're still grappled. Get a B to sixteen. Get get going. Beat a sixteen. What are we doing? You trying to? You want him to put the roll? Oh, on? sorry. Yeah. Beat a nineteen. All right, Rick. Rude, relax. Yeah, that's it. I'm just like this. Okay. He wants to be grappled. What do you mean? He's naked. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you're helping me. Yeah. I'll stay grappled. You sure are anxious to grapple the naked guy. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's like a scene from the Titanic. I don't want to get kicked out of this place. <laughs> he's just saying, he's holding him. All right? He puts, he puts the robe on you like he's a he's a servant, so he puts the robe okay. on you. And I, I turn I around. I turn around and, and I go like this so he can tie me up. He's your... He ties, <laughs> your, he ties your... Uh, thing. He's like... <laughs> yes. <laughs> You're not the first guy to think he was gay. He goes, well, these are these are some of our finest owl bear down. Uh, you may of course take them with you when you go. So oh. what are we supposed to do when we uh after we get our stuff back on? Uh, well go go back go, to enjoy a good night's rest. So. To bed. Okay. Uh your your treatments begin tomorrow. Oh, treatments. Yes. What kind of treatments? Our massage. Our facials. What? We're at a full service. We're at a full service. Cleansing spots. How full service? Be you do it. Hi. I, I look at him like bold. Like bold. <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid I don't understand your question. Well. Well, overseas. You, you know what I mean? <laughs> in, in this land called Asia, <laughs> they have full service. Is that where your people are from? Yeah. <laughs> Not my people, but some people, yes. Okay. <laughs> I just put on my robe. I just walked to the room. I, uh, I'm the last one to leave the bathhouse. I watch everybody leave. As they get out of the, the bathtub, and I, I follow. 
behind Just everybody. Just so you can see everyone's dicks, or? Yeah. Can I try pushing him into the pool? <laughs> sure. With his rope? Sure. <laughs> I've been laying down. <laughs> oh, now you're laying down? No, yeah, because I watched everybody. I got up first. I watched everybody. I've been laying down. <laughs> so you guys go back in. there with Blake. That's real. You guys go back in. Lester is, is sitting there uh, writing in. in uh... We have flip flops on? <laughs> no, they didn't give you any of your feet. Why no. is that Because we, now we're dirty. <laughs> <laughs> he looks up and goes, he looks up and goes, ah, yes, you have been assigned rooms. Uh, C. D, E, F, and G. Uh, if you just go through these doors, hang a left through the, go through these doors, hang a left through the main dining room, and you'll see a sign directing you to the, the dormitories. Good. Are there other patrons here right now? Uh, yes. Uh, Any, you'll see them in the morning. Early wake, early wake up call. Do you guys have breakfast complimentary? Oh, complimentary. <laughs> yes, meals, meals, are, meals are part of our... <laughs> you get meals on wheels. <laughs> In fact, most of you look like you could use a, a, a good cleanse. I could. Yes. You, like you eat a lot of uh, things that are very Just unhealthy for you. Meat okay. and cheese. <laughs> Oh, you must be so called up. I'm doing keto. How do you I'll have you know. I, I haven't. <laughs> for weeks. I don't do carbs. All right, we head to the rooms. Yeah, yeah. I'll go to my room. I'll go to sleep. All right, see you guys. Is all my shit? What are you in? You're in D. Yeah. Nope. Okay. Yes, I'm in D. Is that all the shits in there? Yeah, I didn't take any shit. Okay. Can I examine my stuff to like see if they messed with it? Or... No, it's just all very clean and it, it smells like uh, lavender. Yeah, like some kind of herbal lilac or something. I look at my sword. So where the bad lilac? I'm just making sure it still feels um... warm to the touch. Making sure, like, making sure that the magic properties. Alright, I take my robe off and then I put my, my gear on, back on and uh, I walk out of my room and I, I go knock on Bongo's door. Which so room? Yeah, on yours. Which, which C. Room? C. Oh, exactly. You're right. So you I guys notice that all of your rooms are basically like you can go in, there's the bed, and there's maybe like a foot walkway beside your bed, and then there's a little at the foot of the bed, there's a little uh like lockbox for all your stuff, except there's no locks on anything, including the door, bedroom doors. Your room is like a mini suite. So you have a, a larger bed, a wardrobe, which is the closet that's out of the wall, um, a little wash basin in your own. You have your own access to your own water pump. Hmm. We don't have that? All right, I knocked on, I knocked on room C. The fuck? Okay. I just, he just opened it. Oh, he has a lock. I locked it. No, there's no. Oh, there's no lock. Anything. Oh, I I walk in. I'm like, hey, <laughs> what the fuck do you want? I can't see. <laughs> <laughs> so, a door, one door down, opens up, and you see this like pissed off looking forest gnome sticks his head out and goes, "Shut up! Some people are trying to sleep in here." I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Go the fuck back. This in place room. costs. I'm gonna come down there and show you what for, Mister. I'll turn you into a fucking cod piece. Get back in your room. So I can't see. He's hurting the rumors. Fuck him. Can I can I sleep on your your complimentary couch? No. All right. I uh, sleep I on his couch. <laughs> <laughs> my, my Drake walks through the open door and curls up on his pillow. Where's <laughs> Bingo sleeping? Uh, with my Drake. I'm a fucking man. All right, At some point, then he's gonna cover him up. I, I don't trust yeah, this place. He's got like a queen size bed. Yeah, I don't trust this place. I'm sleeping in your room. But you're not. I am. You're I not. squatted. <laughs> I'm already sleeping. <laughs> I go in, knock on no, Mongo's no, door. I'm gonna start. Hey. I'm gonna start sleeping. I, I, answer, I answer the door. I say, <laughs> come on in. <laughs> I say, come on in. <laughs> so I, I, I grab all the sheets <laughs> and pillows. I'm gonna go forward, drag them down the hallway. <laughs> And I, I, grab, the floor. I grab some chairs from the uh, the main room. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we okay. we could we construct this this ghetto tree fort. <laughs> is, At least is. you didn't stack the beds. <laughs> so, I, I just want to push all these people out. That's not happening. Off. That's not push happening. One. You want that? Yep. All right, we fight over. That's fine because you only grab one of us. <laughs> I got two. I can grab. I don't one have my great shit right on your pillow. You're yeah. allowed. All right. I'm, I'm not leaving. You two fucking ain't. Uh, I'm not leaving. <laughs> I don't care so what you're saying. At this point, you, you start seeing scented steam rising up from the floorboards of your room. And after a moment, there's a, a 
like humanoid shape, but it's formed out of steam. And it, it's looking at you guys, and it says, and it says in a very like strong uh, female voice, "You fucking idiots." It is quiet time. Please return to your rooms and observe respect for your fellow customers. Can you say security engineer please keep my gloves on? Yeah. Go to sleep. Or I can go remove to them. Sleep. I can remove them, but they will be removed from the premises entirely. As much as I return to your rooms to do that immediately. This is our room. Yeah. Yes, it is not. Listen, we're a group. We do everything hey, together. No, I mean, no, 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 we don't see that. We don't see that. So you see, we just bathe together. We're gonna get kicked out. So you, you just grapple them. You see it. in the in the air, in exactly Lester's handwriting. It says, uh, "Bongo, Baronet." Uh, this room is, and the voice says, "This room is listed for single occupants. You must return to your rooms." All right, Bingo. Let's go. I drink I go back to my room. Bingo can stay with Roland. I go back in my room. I shut my door. He's pushing Bingo behind himself. Not getting good. I blocked. Actually, they would have given Bingo his own room. So I guess uh, Bingo would be in G. But they would have given it to him anyway. That's fine. He can stay. I don't trust in G with me. He can't. He can't stay in your room. Yes. No, it's a single occupancy. Hit it. Single occupancy. I go to I go to the front desk and tell him that he tied somebody in his room. Yeah. Yeah, you want on vacation with you guys. I'm on my way back to my room. You guys want to sleep outside in the fucking tent? I, I, I start. I don't give a fuck. I start okay. barricading my door. Uh, I, I, my bed. <laughs> <laughs> I, I slept on worse. <laughs> the Jake and I curl up in our, our room. We go to sleep. I dinged on Dish the Forest Dome. It's like every hotel <laughs> during, <laughs> a, during a baseball <laughs> tournament. Oh, Here's okay. my inspirations. Oh, well. There we go. Thank you. Give my own inspirations. Uh, all all the other people here. Plenty of elevator chair. I hear my heart beat to the middle. All right, I'm sleep out of here. It's fucking nonsense. All right, so you guys get some sleep. Mm-hmm. Round can five. I, what? Before we go to sleep, can I investigate my room? Yeah. See if there's any like tomfoolery going on. They bumped my room. You find a microphone in your light. Uh, Sixteen. Other than the fact that it's it's incredibly clear, like there's not a speck of dirt or dust anywhere. There's nothing to see. Sorry. All right. So round five a.m. You guys start hearing a, a bell ding. What the fuck? Ding, ding. Did, our, fully did our yeah our level of exhaustion did it go? No, you got your. You would get a full uh, a long rest, but you don't lose another level of exhaustion yet. You got that from the uh, the bathroom. The bathhouse. So you still have, if you had two, you still have a level of exhaustion and five hit point max reduction. Right. Okay. All right, so I guess we get out. All right, I'd go move, I'd move my barricade out the way. Yeah. All right. So you guys go out, uh, they direct you to the large dining area for breakfast, uh, and you can see that there's little uh, placards for each person. And it looks like they've actually got different meals for everyone. Do we see that fucking gnome in there eating? Yeah. yeah well, he hasn't started goes, eating yet. But my Drake just goes over and kisses at him. Your Drake kisses at him, and he looks at, he looks at the Drake and goes, you're not even real. You shut your whore mouth. We all TP in room later. Fuck yeah, we are. We are a bunch of thirteen year olds. On this so, <laughs> yep. So you notice there's about uh, half a dozen other people here, including the gnome. Uh, most of them are human. When we scan the room, do we recognize anybody? No. We see a tongue. Did you say everyone sit, kind of sit at their own table? I missed that part. Um, there's several tables. Tell me one click. There, there are several tables, but they would have put the meals out to actually make you so sit long. with other people. No, oh, so with other people. Yeah, okay. so that, like they they want to mix the clientele. So, so, like, sit next to so you guys would probably be all at you guys probably all be all at one table, but not next to each other. Okay. 
So I go to look at the guy next to me. I'm like, so how much does it cost to be your friend? <laughs> he kind of he kind of looks at you and you know he's a he's a human, obviously Gotham. He's really tall for a human, blonde hair. He kind of looks you over and he goes, "I can't believe they let your kind in." And I look at him. I was like, "He's talking about." <laughs> And I'm and now oh, I, get back, I get back to eating, <laughs> like oh, just no like time. barbarically. Hey, buddy, fuck you. I'm just kidding. He, look, he just looks kidding. at he looks at Roland. He looks at Roland. And he goes, "Do you leave the scum man out in this place?" I fart. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> I'm, and I, I, well, I look, look at me. <laughs> I think my nose real hard. <laughs> I know, he just threw she's it. Right. He just threw that trash right in, the, in the, the corner. Oh like, <laughs> what do you want me to do? What do you want to put in? Get up. Get the garbage can. Put it in the fucking can like everybody else. I do it at you the end. You fucking animal. I know that Cleric is playing a role being a disgusting human being, but we don't... Cleric is playing a role being a disgusting human being, but we don't need it in real fucking life. I shut it down. I'm, I'm did you see what he did? He just, he just like threw it off in the corner? I know. He's like, Laura will get to it. <laughs> that was the night Jeff got killed. <laughs> no, she wouldn't no. kill me, she'd kill him. That was the night Cage got killed by Jeff's wife. Uh, Except she doesn't watch the stream sometimes. Yeah. I mean, there was a, there was a Laura AF in here for the longest time. Looking at that. Really? Yeah, probably wasn't that long. Mm. Maybe it wasn't her. Probably wasn't that long. Mm. Maybe it wasn't her. She doesn't even know how to get on Twitch. She watches it? Does she? Okay. Oh, fuck. Maybe it was her. I just had an eye out for where is Bingo Bango just going to go down and come up watching that. Is that really her thing? Yeah. That's, That's hilarious. Cute. I know. That's so cute. Yeah. That's so fucking That's cute. That's adorable. Well, at least your wife actually peeks in from time to time. I tried to tell my wife. She's just little... checking on him. She's kind of fucking interested. I tried to tell my wife. I tried to log in. She's like, is this motherfucker cheating on me? She's trying to do that. She just wants to make sure I'm not talking shit about her to the interwebs. Because cool. the interwebs care so much. Yeah, Hopefully she, she doesn't watch all of her broadcast then. <laughs> she, she doesn't watch all of her broadcast then. Especially episode two at around the 20 minute mark. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Your 30 minute rant. Which one was that? No. Well, no. I don't want to bring it up. I don't know. Yeah. When we're famous, it'll get clipped. <laughs> it is, uh, I'm it sure is on she, YouTube. But when she brings right. it up, she'll let you know which one of us. Yeah. So you remember to say this shit? She can't even fucking Google correctly, so I highly doubt she'll be able to see it. She can't use the I Google. I can't wait Mario, to your clip, phone Mario, Mario, clip that. Oh, it's already clipped. It's already got over like 3,000 views. No, that, what he just said. <laughs> she can't. She, I tell it to her face. What did you say? You can't wait till the phone rings. No, you can't. Yeah. She can't even yeah, Google. Yeah, it's her. You motherfucker! I can't believe you fucking talking shit right now, bitch! You motherfucker! I can't believe you fucking talking shit right now, bitch! Your ass when you get home. Sure. Dallas will be over there in that couch. Look, we got good internet. Yeah, there's Eric. There's Eric. Oh, there's good internet that fucking goes out in history. Oh, one time. It's an outage in safe haven. All right, so you guys have been invited to meet the ladies that run the. We were told we weren't invited, right? We were kind of forced. You were invited. We were told. Mm. Yeah. I mean, okay. you haven't seen anyone around here that can enforce any kind of threat so far. Yet. Hey. Do I get the vibe that this is the cult that has been re-educating people? No. No, nothing like Kyra's that. Inside. Yeah. Not me. Oh, is this a good one? <laughs> I'm really good at deception, though. We don't need re-educating, we just need educating. No comment. I need a uh, cheese grater to these feet. <laughs> the bunions. They take you and they put your feet no. in this thing of water and a bunch of little fish. Yeah, I was just about to say, they have a the little fish tank. Yeah. Yeah. yeah actually, Murlocs just sucking on my feet. Yeah. <laughs> oh. I mean. You look down and you realize you're actually dreaming it's a little bingo. <laughs> <laughs> 
He's just teething. <laughs> <laughs> On my big callous feet. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. I can't wait till Bingo's And watch these puppies in months. <laughs> Trench fire. Oh, Jesus. I can't wait till Bingo's And watch these puppies in months. Trench fire. We just watched last night. Yeah, that's true. Mm. I got swamp foot, dude, for sure. <laughs> I'm always perspirating down there. Nice. You need to see it back here. Oozing. You need to go see the tent. <laughs> so, you guys gonna go to the. Yes. Yes. Alright. So, he leads you. Um, we're the only ones who got invited to this, right? Yeah. He leads you back out to that other, like, the uh, the silo-type building and opens the door and stands by the door and says, um, they'll see you, see you within. Uh. Uh. Okay. All right. I mean, is it bright in there? Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Well, okay. Yeah, made it this far. Uh, I walk in. Full belly. Ready right. for battle. So you walk in, you see these absolutely beautiful elf women. Not elves, not not the uh, uh, low blooded uh, what? dirt elves like him. What? Uh, uh, you see these? <laughs> you said, never mind. Yeah, <laughs> I don't like tall women. Yeah. <laughs> you see these these absolutely beautiful high elves. They they appear to be sisters. They look pretty much identical in terms. Of, appear to be sisters. They look pretty much identical in terms of their features. But one has her skin is is um, like the color of ice, and she has blue hair. Cool. One one has uh, her skin is her skin is like a gentle orange, and her hair is the red of flame. And then the other one has green hair, and her skin is brown like tree bark. Mm, I call firebush. Like they're they're uh the, the the red orange one is sitting in a chair and the other two are standing to the sides I'm as sure. you come in chair and the other two are standing to the sides I'm as sure. you come in and the uh the red one says please close the door behind you. Hey Slama Jerry. Ooh, show off. Uh, we we would like to welcome you personally to the Temple of the Restful Lily and hope that we can Come to some court, sort of equitable arrangement. I mean, meaning phrasing my my our staff informs us that you have been disrespectful of the premises. Not all of us. Disrespectful of the premises. Not all of us. Meaning you're responsible for everyone. Nobody told you. I only answered to one person. Is gone. It wasn't us. It was that fucking gold. <laughs> no, What's your guy's name? Uh, it's you a, really wish to it's another door. receive a full night's rest. I changed. I changed. Our services for those who um, didn't acquire a VIP invite through some sort of means. We killed somebody. Uh, we want we want it off a of raffle. I don't know why you're talking to your VIP guests like this, frankly. Well, because you're, you've been very disrespectful, as I've said. Uh, well, because you're, you've been very disrespectful, as I've said. No, I said that's the truth. Okay, what do you want? Be nice. Well, if, you, if you're going to stay, we request that you allow yourselves to fully embrace the true nature of our treatments. Which is? Relax. Accept that no one here is going to harm you, and undergo each of these treatments with an open mind. What are the treatments? Um, Manny Petty facial. Well, Massage. Uh, today, we would be Detox. starting. We would be starting with a brisk morning exercise. Brisk morning exercise. Oh God! You'll find it very relaxing. <laughs> followed by relaxing. followed no. by some meditation. <laughs> no open mind here. <laughs> then a cleansing. What kind, of, what kind of cleansing are we talking about? Oh, in the in the bath. Oh, another bath. Yes. Bleaching. Yes. We believe we believe that, that um, remaining physically clean is uh, the first step to cleansing one's inward self. Mm, I, I like it. <laughs> All right, we'll be good. So, so no splashing. Be no splashing. Be respectful of our facility and our other guests. Respectful. So we were the only ones in the pool. It's not like we were anybody. Us in the fucking pool. <laughs> Jesus Christ. 
It's a fucking bath. <laughs> It, it's a pool to me. <laughs> it's a watering trough. If, if I have to put my head all the way up like this, to be there, it's a pool. Yeah, you have to do that. When you're fucking doing it's, backstrokes in the fucking. It's not, that, it's not that deep, or It's only like two and a half feet. <laughs> he just went with it. He's doing the crawl. He's just doing full strokes. <laughs> what am I like four foot? <laughs> what am I like four foot? <laughs> Yeah, so it comes up to, yeah, it comes up to like my nipples. <laughs> Again, it's a bat. <laughs> <laughs> That's a poo. <laughs> That's a standing poo. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's do this shit. Is there a pool though? <laughs> it's not a fucking hotel. <laughs> no. It's a bathhouse. <laughs> no. I didn't know if we we're gonna be doing. You know what I mean? Exercises. You guys care if I slap the fucking help that I brought? Uh, we would prefer you avoid violence on the premises. Yes, it, yes. It invites bad energy. It does. Violence. Bad vibes. Uh, very much so. All right. Any recommendations, then? I'll be good. With this one? Particularly. I'll be good. With this one? Particularly. After the meditation, I should be When the help relaxed. ceases to be helpful, we get rid of them. Okay, well, that's a good point. Unfortunately. Uh, if, you don't, if you don't need those one anymore, we can make use of them. No, we need them for the time being. But... If you find you don't need any more of your My recommendation, recommendation, give him a bath blast. Bye. Hey, did I tell you he's been hiding somebody in his room? The child? The child. We're well aware. The chosen one. His name is in the book. Yeah, yeah he's sharing rooms. Why can't we bunk up? He tried up? snitching on you. Ooh. I know. He's just trying to get Bingo Jr. killed. You, you, you are not rogue as a snitch. Get Bingo Jr. killed. You are not rogue as a snitch. You are not children. Yeah, he's, a, he's in the group Game of the Rats. Your case, right? question. Yeah, I need a, I need a adult supervision at all times. Again, if, if any of your retinue at all been needed by you, we would be happy to negotiate an excellent price. For them? Yes. What would you do with them? I don't fucking care. What would we do with you? We have... Many positions around the spire. So you're talking like an adventured servant? You want to be a swimming instructor? I'm you thinking you would, you would be attendant, dishwasher. No, you would be, I'll be the lifeguard. No. Happier, you'd be happier. It's a bathhouse. No one's swimming. It's a bathhouse. No one's swimming. You'd be better being in your entire life. Don't All drown right. in this two foot. We'll, two we'll be good. Even, even, you wouldn't even know. We'll go to the gym and oh, exercise. No, no. Uh, 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 we're good, thank you. I didn't. I asked him. Mm. We're good, thank you. <laughs> I speak you like to speak for you? He's, yeah, he's more secure than anything else. We're, uh, they'll say it. All right, mm -hmm. to the best of your ability. And it's not, so, just, just again, recommendation, full recommendation. Just uh, like, bathe in last night. So. Uh, we believe that, bathe, that, that the ritual purification is uh, an important communal experience. Yep. That's the thing. If you get him in a group, no. he's going to act up. Yep. Do I see any upside That's down pineapples? Adult swim. See oh what? Do you have any upside down pineapples? <laughs> I don't think this is no. Okay, just want to make sure. All right, let's go exercise. Okay. I don't oh. think it was actually exercise. I think they said we're going to do a exercise. So you go out. You go out to the uh, lawn. You see this. You see this uh, minotaur out there. Me? Nope. No. No. Somebody's in shape. Wearing a waist. <laughs> wearing uh, just a waist cloth. In shape. It's a, it's a uh, female minotaur, though. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and she's... <laughs> your, your udders... Uh, female minotaur, though. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 and she's wearing a waist cloth. Yeah. 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 Yeah
He's the wrong uncle. He's uncle Dad. He's not the uncle. All right. So after He's you the guys, <laughs> so after He's you the guys, after, after you guys complete your, uh, after you guys complete your morning tai chi uh, exercise, she says, uh, the the minotaur woman says, now just remain here and meditate for one hour, uh, and then it will be cleansing time, and then uh, we'll have a meal. All right, I meditate with my eyes open. She leaves. Right. So you guys are kind of alone in this little field um, outside the outside the main house. Can we meditate in a circle? Sure. All right. No one's like, th- there's no one's policing you right now. We can right. get in a circle during the queue. Definitely not. Playing soggy biscuit. Definitely not. Playing soggy biscuit. 30 30 minutes goes by and I say, who wants to play Duck Duck Goose? <laughs> oh Jesus. No, let's just get to the spot. My Drake and I are meditating. Everybody, give me a wisdom check. Oh my goodness. Check or same? Just check. <sighs> I don't know why I was logged into my computer to figure that out. 17. Uh, was it just your modifier? Yep. Uh, you gotta do that. This is 16. Why? Are we still at yeah. one level? Yes. 19. He's good at 19. He's really good. 15. 19. He's good at 19. He's really good. 15. You're good. So you lose your last level of exhaustion. Nice. Five hit points off. Yes. You're also good. So as you guys are as you guys are meditating, um, after about ten minutes, you actually feel like you're really um, like something's really happening. You almost feel like you're you're able to like search outside your body, and you hear something calling you from the direction of the bathhouse, like something astral. I'm not falling for that again. Something on the astral plane. <laughs> something on the astral plane is calling to you from that direction. Can you guys hear that? Are you saying that out loud or, or astral? Because they can all hear, if you project to them, they can all hear you right now. I'll, I'll, just, I'll just think that's a phone. What the fuck is that noise? Is this this fucking rogue? Yeah, no, 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 I hear it too. I just think out loud. Who the Hello. fuck is that? Hello. They can hear you. Who are you? My thoughts? They can't hear all of your thoughts, but they, they can only you can only hear thoughts that the other person that you're trying Man, to hear. I can't wait to kill this rogue. <laughs> My thought? I, I yeah. shout out I shout yeah, out to the voice I'm like playing a role Who are you? Game back so you guys can get your PvP. Who we're are you? Game back so you guys can get your PvP rocks off. That's and fine. Move out right. I'm gonna sabotage this rogue Olympics. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I'm going to sabotage your adopted son's life. I love what you said again. Given how many hours I'm going to spend in that Avery Night Eyes dungeon, I'll kill you. <laughs> I ask uh, out loud, uh, uh, who are you? You hear a, you hear a, a voice saying, I'm, this, I'm the spirit of cleansing. I'm trapped beneath the bathhouse. Save me. Hmm. Like, are you like or primordial or something? or something? Are you elemental? Yes. You are? Yes. All right, I start speaking in primordial. What do you say? Here, I, speak. I say, <laughs> do you really speak in primordial? Speak primordial in primordial? Sure. Do you really speak in primordial? Speak primordial in primordial? She responds in primordial, yes. Oh, shit, boys. How are you we trapped here? trying to verify it was actually uh, yeah. when the when the When the elves, there's no when the elves ran here, I was... When the elves ran uh, this place, I was happy to serve, but now those three awful women have taken charge. What's so awful about Oh, them? shit. They're um, some sort of... Monsters, they make soul contracts. Oh fairies? shit! No, they're not fairies. Oh, no. uh, have you have you seen somebody with no tongue? No. Oh, never mind. I'm out of so what? No. Oh, never mind. I'm out so of what? What kind of deals are they making? Uh, all kinds of strange deals. I, I've never encountered anything like it. They they take strange things in exchange for. Granting people's wishes, but um, many people come here, but no one ever actually leaves. Oh, Jesus. Are we in California? I'm ready to drink the fucking Kool Aid. Yeah. We'll just wait for it. Wait for the big Where fucking How do, how do we, how do we yeah, free you? It's fucking my fault. It is, of course. What? How do we free you? Wait a minute. Do we know if we want it? I mean, I, I know, I'm just asking. Still a fair yeah, question. I'm just asking. I mean, I, I know, I'm just asking. Still a fair yeah, question. I'm just asking. I'm trapped beneath the... I'm not really certain. I'm trapped beneath the bathroom. What are you going to do if we do for you? Well, if the, if the spa returns, I would be happy to return to, to serving as a cleansing spirit. Who used to own the spa before the witches the were elf, there? Uh, the, the three elves. Are they still here? I, I haven't sensed them in many, many months. Mm. 
the three elf sisters that we just saw last night. Those are not no the, today. Today. Yeah, today. Those those are those are the Imposters. evil women in the sky. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Okay. Okay. And you um, said you don't know how to get how how are you how are you trapped? I'm not sh- certain. Some sort of how are you trapped? I'm not sh- certain. Some sort of magic they control. How do we get to where you're at right now? It's underneath the bath. It's like, is in, there like a the, secret route or? If you can make your way into the underground beneath the bathhouse. You know any entrances? There. They must have an entrance. They. they well, you used to work here. here, so I figured. Yes, but I, I lived in the waters. I cleansed those that entered the waters. But now they've replaced me with something else. What are they pre- replacing you with? I don't know, but it's evil. You were, you were sucking on that water, too. <laughs> you, were, you were sucking on that water, too. I was. I got a full belly. <laughs> you got yeah, bubble that, guts? That chlorine. <laughs> that evil spirit. How long, how long have you been, or how long has it been since you sensed the... It's been a couple months. Many, many, many months since before the winter began. Oh, they did it. They did it. They did it. Those are fiends. All right. When when we get closer to the bath, we'll we'll talk to you then. I see opportunity here. We might own a bathhouse. That's. What I was just thinking. I'm like, so if we free you, can we be the you know proprietor owners of this business? Oh, uh, you you don't have the. Uh, don't say don't, qualifications. You don't have the right temperament for. It. Don't you say don't, qualifications. You don't have the right temperament for it. I'm afraid. When you we get the rabbit house. It'll, it'll be a stress-free zone, though. Yeah, so we, like, you don't want to get free. We can grow up at some point. What if we hired people to run it? If you found people who were capable of doing so. You work for them? Bingo Jr. Yeah, he could be the CEO. <laughs> his future. Well, <laughs> we'll be stockholders and he'd be the CEO uh, of his own business. We might too long. <laughs> <laughs> I just might make a soul contract to take our fucking road. And start awakening my soul. That, 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 that. Oh, so they did offer to buy us, remember? True. That's true. All right. All right. Okay. So uh, we have to go to the bath now. That was next on the agenda. After meditation. Yes. All right. Does this is this thing still like in communication with us? Or are we not once you kind of break your meditation? Okay. But you guys. Uh, you, another thing I will say is you guys. You realize after a while, you can actually move around. And leave your body behind as long as you're in this meditative state. Uh, astral projection. Exactly. Mm. Ooh. Astral projection. Can anybody else see us if they're not in? No, you're like a okay, like a ghost. Okay. Okay. Can we see each other? Yeah. Okay. Like a ghost. Okay. okay. Can we see each other? Yeah, because oh. you're in the astral plane. Just your your body is completely vulnerable because there's no has no perception. So did she have? Uh, an image that she came out as, or is just a voice? You never saw her because she's trapped. Okay. Well, can I go through the floor? Yeah, absolutely. Can I see what's down there? Uh, so you go down into the bathhouse and go through the floor? Yeah. So underneath the place in the bathhouse, there's an almost identical pool just carved out of raw stone in this stone cavern. And you can see that there's like a, a wispy water spirit hovering above it. Okay, do I see any? Spirit hovering above it. Okay, do I see any uh, stairways or anything? Yeah, there's a, I mean, if you kind of triangulate, you realize those those doors you saw them going in at the back of the bathhouse, there'd be stairs would go down to here. Can they around? probably cleaned your stuff in her pool. Can I search around for any more passages? Uh, like to the thing down there. Okay. Can I see can how the stones were constructed? Were? Or can, can I tell how the stones were constructed? We in the underground area? Yes. It's a cave. It's a natural cave. Oh, okay. okay. Did, did it seem like it was, I mean, could we see if there was any, like, uh, wards or glyphs on, on the... That's an excellent question. Any perception check. On, on the... That's an excellent question. Any perception check. Uh, don't screw this up. This should be a good roll for you. Nice and easy. No pressure. Uh, 17. There you go. Uh, yeah, there are wards, and looking at them, you realize, because you are a cleric... These are binding wards. They hold things like elementals or demons or devils in place. So, how many wards are there? There's four. Okay. Do we want to free this thing, or do we want to just kill the bitches and keep this thing down here and find somebody to run this place for us? <laughs> down here and find somebody to run this place for us. <laughs> when I know that the... I like, I like to cut you up here. That all the wards would have to be 
dispelled for to her, for her to leave or I mean, would it? A religious she just stayed, this was their original place anyway. So she's just bound to this now. Right? Yeah. I mean. Oh, did they? Yeah, that's a good question. Was she bound before? No. Or she, did she just stay? She at chose her, to stay. She chose to stay. Okay. Uh, wards. Nineteen. A nineteen. Yeah. So you know that you would have to disrupt all four wards to free her. But she can. It, it, she has a higher chance of escaping on her own. The fewer wards. Okay. Own the fewer rewards. Okay. Alright. Well, did, did, we, did, uh, did he see the um, three, the three, three sisters while he was traveling about? Not where he went. If you want to try to go to their house, you know where they're at. So <laughs> do you somebody want to go check it out? What in the astral out? plane? I'm, I'm not in the astral. I'm staying with myself right now. What did you want to check out there? See where they are at, the three sisters. I go there. Really? You want to go check? Yeah. I'll watch over the bodies. Let's, uh, okay, so we got to check. Yeah. I'll watch over the bodies. Let's, uh, okay, so we got to come up with a plan of action. Are we just going to see where they are? Yes. Are we going to confront them and say, hey, we know you're not I say else? we try sneaking down there. No, no, he was talking about seeing oh. them through the, the, the oh, gotcha. while in the okay. astral. Okay, okay, cool. Yeah, go oh, on. yeah, yeah, I'll go search around. So as you head over toward toward where their house is, the closer you get to it, the more it looks basically like the upside down from Stranger Things. It gets it's no real oh, okay. So it's real dark, darker, and everything evil. is everything. The grass and everything dead in the astral plane is dead. Everything is everything in here is dying. The house looks like it's crumbling. Is everything in here is dying? The house looks like it's crumbling oh, and in terrible shape. And uh. As you get close enough, you realize the actual walls of the house and the astral plane are an impassable barrier. It's kind of like the so you can't go the, the 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 birdhouse that the witch from uh, the Witcher was in. Okay, makes sense. So we couldn't find them at the past. It was like the uh, upside down. Um, this astral plane that was dead. The passable barrier is trying to find the three chicks. So you, yeah, you can't get into their actual tower. So I say, so we'll do, do you guys want to sneak down to? Uh, down to Down to Sorry, guys. And then we'll take it higher. Sure. Well, we're going to try and free the spirit first. Yeah. The spirit guardian? Yeah. Do we, think, do we think that this would alert them, though? Do we want to get the drop on them? If well, happens? if you break their... If you break that bond, they'd probably feel it. If they cast something, would we know that? What do you mean if they cast something? If So if they cast that ward, and then somebody breaks the ward, would they feel that? Um, they probably can sense whether or not there's an distort, like yeah, a disruption so what do you mean with, check? within their, you know what I mean? I'll oh, guide oh, you. Oh, 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 oh. Within their, you know what I mean? I'll oh, guide oh, you. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Okay. I'll guide you. I'll guide you. I'll guide you. Yep. I that. <laughs> yeah, nice job, dude. I got plus four, dude. dude. What do you have, plus zero? Yeah, but proficiency? I do. Were you helping me out? Sure. I guidance you. <laughs> if you knew that. that. <laughs> I just love all the meta getting me going into this. 23. <laughs> <laughs> so what was your first roll? 15. Oh, 15 is actually good. Uh, you don't think so. Like, like wards are, most wards are set and forget. Okay. They and just I, do what they do. And I'm thinking, like, even if we write through wars, even if they, they realize what the fuck is happening, if we're, we're fighting, like, in the underground cavern, or even in the fucking bathhouse, that cleansing spirit is going to be out. Hopefully they help us out while we're fighting these spirits. So he would be able to tell you, and actually I said Druid, so would he. Both these two would be able to tell you, that cleansing spirits can have zero fighting capability. No, I know it's not going to have any fighting it's, capability. It's, they're, they're, they're designed to heal and like... Yeah, uh, shape water. They can, they, they can remove like mental illnesses and, and stuff. I mean, if, if Spirit. Yeah, like, like we're in the water. We all have a Only D and D mental health. Yeah, disease. like if you're artistic, you can hey, show you can you can cure it. Screw your sculpting. Like, like like a balloon or some shit. <laughs> as we're fighting on like the ground on the. Uh, all right, well, you guys are gonna try to sneak down to the van. Yeah, yeah. Sure. All right, cool. Everybody, give me a group stealth roll. Um, I cast. Oh, whatever. Oh, perfect. I was gonna do that. Good. God bless. Go ahead. Plus ten. Okay. Remember to disadvantage if you're wearing medium or heavy armor. Oh, boys. All right, I got a. Uh, twelve. Twenty. Fifteen. 
a plus ten with fifteen. Yeah, <laughs> I know. This is because of nineteen. Oh, you good? Sorry, what? Fifteen. Twelve. Eighteen. Nineteen. What? Nineteen. Oh, jeez. Twenty-eight. Yeah, you guys kicked that thing's ass. So you sneak through the bathhouse, even though there's some people in there. Uh, other other clients on a different rotation. <laughs> <laughs> but you guys, you guys like somehow. Gage is trying to spy, to like look at the people in the bath. I slap them on the back. Like, yeah, we're like, like, it's like moving weird. Yeah. Like, using, <laughs> using the steam for cover and whatnot. Jesus. And we you can make your way to the back. Army crawling. Hot Jesus. And, and we can, can make your way to the back. Army crawling. You stay completely still. They can't see you. We start going down the stairs. <laughs> so congratulations, you get to have one combat tonight. Huzzah. Huzzah! Yeah, but then we own a bathhouse. We're like Russian mm-hmm. oligarchs. <laughs> You're Russian one, then? Dave, say that word. What? Oligarchs? Oligarchs? <laughs> oligarchs? No <laughs> regrets. Oligarchs? No regrets. No regrets? That's how I live my life. No regrets. <laughs> I don't know what I don't even want. All right, so you guys go downstairs. You guys hike it downstairs, and you see exactly what you guys that went downstairs saw in the astral projection. I tried to get minis for this, but Amazon couldn't get it here until like the 25th. Is there a way you can center this? Because all we're seeing is a fifth. Is there a way you can center this? Because all we're seeing is a white square. I'm just going to start ordering stuff every week. No, there's actually nothing I can do because I'm using uh, dynamic dungeons. And that's paint? No, if I was using dynamic paint, I could move it. It's just a joke, Ted. Bite me. All right. Oh my God. No. So yeah, you guys come down the stairs. You move that shit, dude. And uh, no, motherfucker, the mini. No, I'm moving this fucking. Like I said, <laughs> like I said, you see, you see the the bound spirit, but then you see that elf emerging from the steam, and he kind of, uh, and he kind of, uh. Shakes himself off. This is the elf. Was this the, the tall elf that was the uh, like the, the butler, the yeah, lifeguard, yeah, yeah. the lifeguard? Uh, and his clothes morph into black armor, and you can see that he he looks um uh, he looks really uh, um like emaciated and thin, as if he hasn't ate or slept in months. And he reaches to where he would have a sword, but there's no sheath, and he pulls out of the air this black blade, and he says. And he says, I knew you would discover the lady's secret sooner or later. No, time to die. Shame. Mm. All right, what'd you get? Um, 19. All right, Mongo. And bonus. Cassius. Uh, 7. And Gawarn. 17 plus 4 for a 21. Oh, I was going to say, I'm not doing that math for you. Tyrell. Four. What is it? Tyler? What the fuck is Tyler? Tyler. 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 Oh, it's Tyreal. Okay. So, Tyrell. Uh, we, obviously that's the three ladies there, right? No, sorry, I just moved They're not here. Oh, They're not just here. Just them for now. Yeah. Okay. I am going to shoot at him. That's 16, so that's a 24. I'm sorry, 26. And I'm going to use the uh, Star Spray Ted, and I'm going to um, have the moats attack. Uh, so that's only when have the moats attack. Uh, so that's only when you do the shotgun. Uh, the two wielder can ready the crossbow without loading bolt, and the Star Spray will create a bolt of pure light instead. Uh, when taking the attack action, the two wielder can substitute the following for one, and only one of his attacks. A 15-foot cone of tiny molten orbs of light fire from the crossbow. Right. That's right. That's your cone. So you'd have to be within 15 feet of them. Okay. There, I, you know what? I'm going to save it just in case. Okay. Yeah. I thought at first originally when I was thinking about it, I thought the girls were there too, but I'll just do the regular attack. Sorry. For now. That's all right. Not a problem. I'll just do the regular attack. Sorry. For now. That's all right. Not a problem. Not a problem. So that's uh, 1d8 plus 4. Oh. Uh, 8 plus 4 is 12. Oh, that sucks. Uh, so that's six, but I'm also going to use my Drake's damage for another three, so nine damage. That's first. All right. Um, yeah, you just take Thirteen seven. on the dice. So that's twenty-three. That's also a hit. Okay. 
Uh, Nagmore damage. Are you going to move your Drake up next to him? I am going to move my Drake up next to him. And the Drake is a Drake up next to him. And the Drake is going to bite him. Uh, oh, yeah, that's on your bonus action, so go ahead. Uh, that one only did 10. That's a miss. Alright, so on addition of count 20, uh, the room fills up with steam. You can hear the trapped spirit screaming in pain uh, as heat and pressure forces the steam out of it, and everybody needs to make a wisdom saving throw. Initiative count 20? Yeah, like an environmental effect. Yeah, like an environmental effect. Wisdom saving throw? Mm -hmm. Like a layer action? 15. 15? 3. Fail. 20. 20. 15. 15. Um, sorry. Uh, 20. Okay, so you're the only one So you're going to take 10 points of fire damage. And you are blinded this round. Uh, the steam is just all around you. Everyone else takes 5 fire damage. 5 fire? Blinded by the light. Alright, Roland, you're up. Alright, Roland, you're up. So you're blinded until uh, initial count 20 next turn. Oh, I forgot. You, I got to roll for the Drake, right? Yes. Uh, he fails. So he took how much? He takes 10 fire and he's blinded until... Okay. Initiative count one. All right, Roland. Right. Uh, three, six now. I'm going to dagger him. Uh, sport can die. So 18 hit. Uh, sport can die. So 18 hit. You got it. One plus four to hit. But yeah, that does hit anyway. Uh, um, I'm sorry, plus seven. Okay, that makes um, more sense. Yeah, we'll get it. Uh, 5, 8, 10, 12, uh, so 16 points of damage on that one. Ow! And then I'm gonna throw my second dagger. Uh, 19 hit on that one, and it's yep. 8 damage. Everybody that isn't blind needs to make a wisdom saving throw as he peels off his face and beneath you can see the, you can see that you know he's got a skull and everything but in his eyes and everything but in his eyes you can see all the way to hell he peeled his face off and you need to make a wisdom saving throw all right on 16. your drink is not because he's blind okay 20. 16. Can I use my my boom save? Your what? My boom saving throw. Boom. My boom from the thing that we got. Oh, what, how, uh, what does it do? It's, it it just gives me a reroll for one failed save. I reroll. Yeah, there's my. Yeah. Then go ahead. There's my. Yeah. Go ahead. There's my. Yeah. Natural twenty. I got nat twenty. So twenty two. Two rerolls too. All right. So no one is affected by the. What would it have done? Uh, you, you are. So you have to wait. No, that's fine. You're frightened. You're frightened by him for one minute, and if you're if you're within thirty feet of him and you're frightened of him, you're basically screwed. Um, I think that was blind. Right. Yeah, that worked out pretty good for you. Uh, <laughs> that just been bad. Who's near him? Bongo. Cool. He. Who's near him? Bongo. Cool. He is, he's also going to do a bonus action. Uh, he he doesn't hit you with the sword, he just reaches out and taps you with it, okay. and the black stuff goes all over your body. You need a constitution saving throw. Jesus is good. Yeah, and you have his advantage because you're blind. No, not on a con save. 21. Yeah, you're fine. My drink got blinded too, right? Yep. Mongo, yup. Did you get him? Um, <laughs> I'll just bonus action Janik's mic for the time being. Okay. And then bonus action Janik's mic for the time being. Okay. And then blinded. And I just like. You can attack it at disadvantage. Yeah, disadvantage. Yeah. Okay. I'll attack that. Just smell them out with your nose. Yeah. <laughs> so 
d8 plus a d6. Can I use uh, uh, on initiative 20. Can I use dispel magic on one of the glyphs? So after Jeff goes, basically, okay. Can you use the spell? Yes, but you have to roll. Not that you know that. What do I have to roll? <laughs> it, make a wisdom check. Just straight wisdom. Wisdom check? Yep. Shit. That sounds good. That sounds good. Um. You bet. Shit, yeah! What, what does the 10 get me? Nothing. Mm. So you cast the spell magic, you use the spell slot, but nothing happens. It doesn't clean off like half Fucking the room. Great. Anything else? There's no constellation prize. <laughs> Fucking great. Oh, that's. Can I have bonus action try again? Nope. Can I use this inspiration? <laughs> um, I'm gonna. Uh, the chapstick? Bonus, bonus action wild shape. I got this. My <laughs> bonus action wild shape. Uh, I got this. In my nice archer form. Rain. I'm gonna cast a guiding bolt. Okay. Uh, nat 20. Four, six. Uh, so hold on, before you do the damage. You said a nat 20? Yeah. Nat 20? Wow. Weird. So, he, uh, you guiding bolt him? He puts up his sword, your guiding bolt, your bolt splits in half, reforms, zaps right back to you. Splits in half, reforms, zaps right back to you. Mm. <laughs> you have the worst fucking luck. Christ, we hardly knew you. <laughs> the full damage? Yeah, you took the crit damage, dude. Uh, so, oh my god, you're dead. <laughs> it's, only, it's, you gotta only this. it's only crit damage because I also rolled it. You gotta reroll all that, too. Yeah. Add that and reroll it. Yeah. Add it again, roll it again. 6, 8, 11, 17, 18. 21. We had six right there. What? We had six dice right there. You should be rolling 8d6. Oh. 66. Oh, were you up casting it? No. Because casting it? No. Because guiding bolt's 46 at first level. So would you, so you cast at level three? So a, crit, a crit would be eight dice. So if you've already rolled oh, six, well, you need two more. Did you cast at level three? I did it at level one, but I read it. I thought it was 66. No. So, so roll two more. Just add it together. That's why I just never trust my eyes for these spells. So to oh, nice. Oh, gosh, another 8. So, uh, 25. I thought you said, said another 8. You're at 21. 21 oh, 29. so 29. So you take 29. Oh, you cheating and lying. <laughs> and you're glowing. And you're glowing. Why are you always lying? Why are you always Any bonus actions? Why are you always Any bonus lying? actions? Yeah, I'm going to shoot him with my... Uh, oh, no, you already bonus actions to watch it. Yeah, and then uh, I'm on activation. I can just use my bonus action. With the archer one. Obviously, Ted. Things? You didn't know that? Yeah. Yeah, I don't think that's right. <laughs> 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 He's got a scroll. When I wild chip, I got my action ammo bonus. In fairness, in fairness, he was right about the... Uh, oh, shit. Right the uh, you, get, you get a bonus bonus action. What did you wild chip? And as a bonus action. So, yeah, you can do your... Uh, so, non activate. Make your stupid attack. Range, so, spell attack. Yeah, okay. Make sure you 1d8. Er. Okay. Make sure you 1d8. Er. What is your... Uh, now, 1d20? My star arc arc form. Okay. Yeah, he's Orion now. Four eight. Damage. Yeah. Uh, yeah, make an attack roll first. Nope. <laughs> that is a good point. <laughs> <laughs> no, I hit that. I fucking hit. For a two. A ten total. <laughs> yeah. That's a miss. <laughs> so good work. What the fuck <laughs> are we doing? Here? <laughs> After my turn, my Drake will be not blind anymore. Uh, no, after the initiative twenty. So yeah. after it's done. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Alright, uh... Okay. Alright, uh... God damn, Mario. That's what happens when you miss three fucking months. <laughs> Leave turtle on. <laughs> he's gonna, he's gonna try to date, he's gonna try to date Ronda Rousey. Yeah, you better watch yourself around Tyreel. <laughs> he's 
Scatterbolt himself. <laughs> that motherfucker. <laughs> 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 you in your sleep. I'm just yeah, dude, he'll kill himself, dude. <laughs> Ow. He's over there committing seppuku, right? <laughs> and I'm going to uh, use my favorite fall on that cat sucker. Seems you're rude, but. Yeah, it's whatever. God, Jesus, fuck. I rolled three two, whatever. God, Jesus, fuck. I rolled three twos. Plus uh, four. So, ten damage on the first one. <laughs> At least you hit. <laughs> Yeah, and, then the one. and then try to say yeah. Uh, that's a thirteen. That's a miss. Okay. Uh, so. Okay. Oh, you you can do your your bonus action, so you can you can do your dragon. Oh, I can, even though he's blind. Yeah, he can move. Okay, so I'm gonna move him over just there. Just if he attacks, his disadvantage. Yeah. Okay. You can give him the dodge. Or he can have the better dodge. Give him the dodge. Or he can have the better dodge. Uh, he misses. <laughs> All right. So, initiative, initiative count twenty. The steam, the steam clears out, and a light shines out from the center of the cleansing spirit. Shine bright. You hear her scream uh, as the beam of light hits the blackguard, and it looks like he is getting healed. So. Bye bye, the beautiful sea. I will do me happy. Is the blind going? Yeah. Okay. Did you right, spell work or no? Alright. Uh, did you right, spell work or no? Alright. Uh, I didn't roll high enough. Uh, 19 hit? Uh, yes. 3, 6, 12, 13, uh, 17 damage on that one. Nice. Jesus. Fuck that guy. Put it. Put it in. Oh, for an at 20. Oh shit. Alright, All right, so that's 3. Three, six, so that's ten more damage. Right. Too bad you had to cut out that first attack. I know. All right. I still it got high rolls on my D. No. All right. I still it got high rolls on my D. Where's Mario? He's, He's uh, right here. Staff. Almost dead. Okay. He's going to go ahead. He will provoke from both the Drake and Oh, my uh, God. Mondo. You're at advantage, dude. You're glowing, dude. Uh, if I provoke, is that use my reaction? Yeah. Yeah. 15 hit. Does one hit? 15. Okay. I will not. So he walks up. He touches Mario with his sword, so he can't see save it, though. Jesus Christ, how many of his characters are you going to kill? Power death. 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 Nice, nat 20. Do you okay. send that back? So he can't see <laughs> oh, oh, my God! <laughs> Is it a targeted spell? No, then I can't. <laughs> um, but he is going to go ahead and just smack you with this. <laughs> shoot, him in, shoot him in the dick! Disintegration sword. Right. <laughs> that was a d12. That doesn't help. Pretty sure he just missed you. Oh, no. 17? Yeah. I got a 17. Okay. No. So he hits you for a 9... So he hits you for nine slashing and nine necrotic. Oh, I'm dead. Can I redirect that Are you attack? down? Yeah. Can I redirect that attack at a wall? <laughs> no. <laughs> it was over 50 points of damage. <laughs> you gonna redirect it to the cleansing spirit? What about to a glyph? I feel like that would happen. No, those no, are not I mean, this heals are best when he's down anyway. So. <laughs> he's not gonna heal. So him. is he actually down? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah and you failed the best save. Nice. No, you failed too. Why? Because he hit him again when he was down. <laughs> <laughs> Threw him in the face! What did I do to you? <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I can't reach you. Put my character next to <laughs> There's a little book called The Monsters Know What They're Doing. If you're ever going to DM, read it. Alright, so first attack. For 19. Yes, that's it. For 13 damage. Ow! What character should I play next? <laughs> Make a fucking barbarian, would you? Yeah, dude. You got, you got a guy that can max healing when you're down. I'm helping you out. Put your crying. Oh, or, or, you or, <laughs> or, or I can just follow. When you're down, I'm helping you out. Put your crying. Oh, or, you or, you or, 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 or I can just follow. Or I can hit you because you didn't pay our taxes. <laughs> <laughs> and then you'd have three death saves. And you did. Dead, dead. Uh, does this. 16? We're just gonna get a roll new character every week. <laughs> yeah. We, we <laughs> have a diamond. We can revive you. you. You're gonna roll a new He's character the, uh, every time you show up once every two oh months. Oh my. Can I, <laughs> can I shove him into the wall? 
for an extra D6? Yeah. With the hammering horn? All right, give me a strength save. All right, give me a strength save. Oh, no, I guess not. 19? 18. Yeah, that's it. Okay. That shove, when he shoves people out of a uh, hitting area, or, does that does provoke? Not provoke. Right. provoke is only when you use your movement. Yeah, that's what that is. Cassius, you're up. All right, well, since I have to heal him. You don't I can... have to. Shut up, Ted. But if he fails the death save. <laughs> what am I? Am I already in his five foot square? Yes. All right, I'll uh, touch you with the level two uh, cure wounds for two uh, cure wounds for 16 plus your wisdom. 20, 20 health. Nice. I can't wait to do that. Anything else? Uh, and then I will use... <laughs> I can't catch a bro. He's getting past everybody. Right. You no. were glowing and you, no. the advantage was only your last one round. Dude, you, <laughs> did you just buy those dice? You better throw them away right now. Yeah, and literally. Alright, Gage, what are we doing? That's, uh, that's, that's it. I can't do anything else. Alright, Tyrell. Uh, Tyrell. <laughs> you gotta stand up. Check, you stand up. You should touch yourself and heal. You gotta stand, stand up. You should touch yourself and heal. You gotta stand your ground. You get you get one heal per campaign. <laughs> <laughs> you already fucking used it. Yeah, that counts for all the characters uh, we're talking that campaign too. I'm gonna bonus action uh, into my chalice form, and then what's that get you a higher AC? Hmm? Chalice, I would assume it's probably more healing. Yeah, it's a it's a healing form. Then you know, healing form. Then I'm gonna cast more. Then I'm gonna cast cure wounds on myself. He smites you now. <laughs> Next, when this character dies, you have to look up the most obnoxious character you can play. Hardest die. to kill. Still fucking die. No, I'll, I'll, I'll just tell him no, and then go make another character. Six. Don't fucking die. Ted will find a way. You again, end your turn. Again, there is, there is no character that's hard for you me to kill. Next it's way. just characters that are hard for me to turn. kill Six. without being another crazy. Another one d eight plus four. Another one d eight plus four. Are you done? Yep. He's back up and healthy. All right. Wow, that that chalice form is freaking dope. Uh, all right. Not the Good morning, you're up. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm gonna shoot that druid that just rose from the dead. <laughs> <laughs> so is he? Oh, zombie! <laughs> <laughs> is he adjacent to me now? Uh, no. Uh, no, he is. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. My character. Mother. Oh, but I have the crossbow. You have crossbow. Yeah. Matter. Yeah. Okay. Shotgun blast Mario. <laughs> uh, 23. Uh, yeah, I see it. Uh, so that's 10, 14 plus 4, so 18 damage on that one. Alright. Nice, Amasu. And then uh, my second attack is 26. Favorite foe is uh, both attacks, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, 8 and 4 is 12. Oh, nice. Plus 4, so another 16. And then the Drake's going to attack. Screw you, Drake. You gotta move your Drake. Uh, that's only 14. Is that that's it? That's a miss. Okay, yeah. attack. Screw you, Drake. You gotta move your Drake. Uh, that's only 14. Is that that's it? That's a miss. Okay. Alright. So, steam goes off. I need everyone to make counts. Here's the same it's The creature, is the creature part of the initiative? Ooh, it's not gonna be close. What do you mean? The, the fucking spirit. It, it doesn't have an initiative. Why? I want to stone it and put it to sleep. Charming. Um, well, if nothing else, it's immunity to put it to sleep, so it wouldn't matter. Okay. And you said what save, sorry? Con. I got... And you said what save, sorry? Con. I got a 13, the Drake got a 9. 21. So 10 fire and blind for both you and the Drake. Oh, fuck. That's not going to matter, trust me. 21. 21, you're fine. Oh, 5. 10 fire and blind. Gage, what'd you get? Oh, I failed. Okay, 10 fire blind. 22. 5 fire not blind. Not blind. 10 fire blind. All right, you're so up. Who's not blind? I'm up. <laughs> it doesn't matter. <laughs> Fuck. I can watch myself die. <laughs> <laughs> this uh, this dagger and sneak attack might hit you if you're not careful. Well, you can't, you can't sneak attack <laughs> if you're blind. It might hit you if you're not careful. Well, you can't, you can't <laughs> sneak attack <laughs> if you're blind because you have disadvantage. Uh, this dagger might hit you. 
<laughs> nat one. Nat one. Uh, eight and seven. So fifteen is fifteen. That's fourteen. Oh, that's an twenty. So fourteen. Uh, but so twenty. Yeah, he's gonna use his. He's gonna use his You're stabbing Dennis. All right. Okay. Uh, five oh, oh, hold on. Sorry. Uh, five oh, oh, hold on. Sorry. I do the work for the redirect. Oh well, he tries to stab you, but he misses. Cool. So he he you go to stab. He twists and. and it's that good him, but it cannot penetrate his armor. Does it hit Bingo Jr.? No, it does not. No. <laughs> <That's> not. <laughs> uh, <God! laughs> Is that it for him? That's it for me. All right. He's going to... He's, he's screwed no matter what he does, so make a con save. He touches you with his sword. Me? Yep. Yeah, he's all the way over there. Oh, sh you're not adjacent to him? Oh, yeah, he provokes all the way over there. Oh, sh you're not adjacent to him? Oh, yeah, he provokes my right dad. Good morning. Good morning, blind, right? Yeah. Yeah. I've seen this on Pornhub. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's about to get fucked. Uh, this guy that you seen on Pornhub? That's a four? That's a four? Uh, yeah. Okay, cool. Smite. I'm actually going to get one smite off before the end of this stupid fight. Uh, then he goes to attack you. With the long sword. The long down. I don't want to hear about your fantasies. Well, that's a I don't want to hear about your fantasies. Well, that's a 19 to die, so that's going to hit. 26. So it hits you for 9 slashing, 9 necrotic, and you are blind for 1 minute. Oh, fuck. <laughs> so it attacks you again. And though that one misses even though you're, even though, uh, you're blind. Well, now is your AC 15? Fuck off. Your AC 15 or lower? No. Okay. Fuck off. Let's nice. fuck off. <laughs> All right, Bongo. Okay. I mean, you should be able to hit him. You're not blind. That's uh, 12, 19. Yep. Or? No, he's going to read her. Uh, who else is near you? To the Drake. Come on, damn it. Can I cloud room that attack to put it back to him? Sure can. Uh, sure. Probably not, but sure. Okay, well, there's, there's no flat roll or anything like that. But yeah, yours yours works differently than mine. Yeah, so, okay, well, there's, there's no flat roll or anything like that. But yeah, yours yours works differently than mine. Yeah, so, 7 plus 4, 11? Yeah, you can't forget the points. Okay. Nice, Amasu. All right, so you have successfully killed him, and we will pick up next session with you guys... Freeing the water spirit? No, we gotta kill the bitches. Well, we gotta take down the wards. Well, I don't think the yeah, but we either way we gotta do both, right? Well, yeah, we gotta take down the wards and we can kill the bitches. Yeah, because he ain't gonna help us in the fight anyway. And hey, when we look at the guy, do we have anything? Do we not lose him yet? And hey, when we look at the guy, do we have anything? Do we not lose him yet? Uh, we'll get to that next week. If we kill the bitches, do the wards go away automatically? Mm, no. Let's fire and forget. No, yeah. Not again. Uh,